Gentlemen, Jeff Grubb, Mike Minotti, hello. Woo! Woo! Yeah, let's go. I let's, love demos more than life itself. Let's demolish wow. the discs. Jesus. Okay. That's what we do here, right? I, you, you really? Well, okay, you criticized me last time for coming in weak, and now you seem upset about how hard I came in. Okay, how about, let's, let's, try, okay let's flip it around. Okay, let's try one where Minotti, you're coming in kind of soft, and then Grub, you're a fucking maniac. You ready? Oh, All sure, right. sure. Yeah. All right, here we go. <laughs> Everyone, we are here with another episode of Demo Derby. I'm Dan. I'm also here with Mike. Yeah, hey, how's it going? That's Mike. And then we've got Jeff Grubb. Through your demos, I have discovered that I am Satan himself. All right. I am ready with that energy to lift up and show you fine folks at home. As you see in my lap, I have a uh, giant oversized binder of this is just the PlayStation binder. The Xbox one is green. I color coded. I'm a thoughtful wow. man when I put together my disc organization and then I opened up to uh, pages that uh, don't have any discs. Um, there you go. There's all the discs. All the discs are here. Uh, well, almost all of them. Jeff and Mitch. Hello. Yeah, well, we're <laughs> waiting for you to say the, uh, the part yeah, of the sentence. Waiting for. Jeff and Mitch, pause. What yeah. what? Right. I think I was waiting for you to be like, yes, or something. So let's try uh, it. Uh, yes, sir, right. sir, sir, right. yes, sir, right. sir, right. yes, sir. Right. Jeff we're and here Mitch. to engage, sir. Jeff and Mitch. Yes. <laughs> Last time on this here program, uh, we did the thing where you both pick a number, I divide by two, and then I pick the corresponding demo disc. I would like to do that again, but we got a short one. Because of the random nature we've been uh, messing around with, we got a short one. We didn't uh, you know, know what we were walking into. And so we figured, hey, normally it's been a month, two months, maybe more between demo derbies, but we wanted to get down to the grindstone. We want to look at some more demos with you fine folks at home. So I have the binder. I will need numbers from you two gentlemen that I will Mike, plug into my cellular please. telephone. What 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 is the range here again? Uh, just, it's like, it's, 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 keep it between like twenty like and one hundred and fifty. Uh, twenty hundred, a hundred and thirty. One thirty plus Grub's number. Okay, I'm, let me think here. I'm just going to try to make sure I don't go. Uh, Ninety six. Ninety six equals divided by two equals. That would mean one thirteen. Now the first thing I need to check. It looks like we have not done an OPM one thirteen before. Let me see if we have a one thirteen. One thirteen. One oh four. I'm. I have a one ten. That was the Guitar Hero one. I'm sorry. We're Pick gonna again. To, we're gonna have to go lower, Mitch. Uh, I will start with 89. 89 plus. Uh, all right. So let's do, uh, let's do 45. Equals divided by two equals 67. We have not done an OPM 67. Ooh. Do we have an OPM 67? Do we have o opium? Opium. Yeah, I was going to say that just sounds like the word opium. <laughs> it um, just sounds like oh, yeah, drugs. We do. I'm going to hold this up. Somewhere, not far from me, Ben Hansen is twitching because this is either a frequency or an amplitude I see on this disc. Ooh, <laughs> and or. <Baby. laughs> All right. Don't I you have no rhythm, though? Uh, uh, I don't have rhythm in the music sense. Um, I have rhythm in the, like, <laughs> you have gamer rhythm. <laughs> uh, yeah, I have, like, like the punch other out. senses of rhythm, well, yeah. Look, look, I have rhythm in, like, punch out. Is that musical? I mean, it's yeah, frame kind of. I guess. I mean, it's not music, I wouldn't call it. Well, it's, it's the sweet music, the sweet science, I call it. But it's enough just, about yeah, Punch yeah. Out. I'm going to put this disc <laughs> that I'm holding up <laughs> into... Man, I think that's the first time you've ever said, that's enough about Punch Out. It is, it is, yes. I'm playing on shoot hardware. I am about to put this disc into my console, and we will see. Hopefully, Minotti gets a uh, submarine theme or something like that. I hope, oh, I guess, I hope. I'm really theme pulling like for a, him. Another JRPG that you two will like yawn at what? i get very excited we wouldn't have done oh, that yeah. we are respectful reverent <laughs> we are game historians that respect yeah. things that may not be in our particular wheelhouse Very deeply yeah in my mind that's the whole reason i am on demo derby <laughs> is to just stop you two from being disrespectful to jrpgs <laughs> <laughs> no don't tell him but it's because he's fun to talk to on these Aww. things yeah, don't let him don't know put that. him over don't, too much he's gonna yeah, don't, let, about don't let it go to yeah. his head okay wow. all right Turns out Man, this is fun. People are really nice to me until I accidentally call them the wrong first name. <laughs> Who would do that? <laughs> All right. Here we go. 2003. Okay. I feel like this is a sweet spot. We, we've hit our stride on the PS2 life cycle at this point. It's been oh, out yeah, for a yeah. few years. It's it's a heavy hitter. Oh, well, let's start with the sports games. Here we go. <laughs> Wait. Okay. So we do have extras. We have extras. Okay. We have inside the game. Okay. We got stuff going on here. Let's oh, start. Come with on, the boys. Let's go to the playground. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Please. What? Why did they just disappear? Everything just I think it's Wait. Okay. It's probably loading some video or something. Yep. Okay. I think we have to watch an Atari ad first. Oh, sweet. Is that Jack Nicholson? Oh. 
What is this? Is this Is that the guy from the Soprano? Is that what is? Twenty five to life? What is going on? Oh, it's your next Blake Club game. What is this? This looks cool. What are you talking about? I mean, this looks terrible. <laughs> I don't want to do this. Oh wait, that was, was that the Golden, the Golden Eye? Eye. Whoa, what the it fuck? Is. What the this fuck? Is the Golden Eye health thing. That is, is what is oh, happening? This is Fugitive Osama Hunter. Bin Laden? This is Fugitive Hunter War on Terror. This is absolutely Fugitive Hunter War on Terror. <laughs> Is it a fighting game also? Um, yes, God. yes. It's a first person shooter until you have to like fist fight Bin Laden. Uh, what was was Navarro talking about this? Was like one of they, my future Blight Clubs? Yeah. It's from they the developers. They this game on September 12th, didn't they? Yeah. <laughs> yeah like, I have an idea. <laughs> this is going to save Atari. <laughs> uh, is it supposed to be bad? It's a game where you fist fight Bin Laden, Mitch. What do you think? <laughs> I, look, don't come. <laughs> <laughs> you put, do, you, uh, do you compromise him to a permanent end? <laughs> we can only it hope looks, so. It looks like a game that would come in a cereal box in the idiocracy world. Like yeah. If they, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, all the stars. Here we go. We're going to start with NCAA Final Four 2003. Hell yeah. Let's go. Man, they used to make college basketball games. That's how thirsty people were for oh, sports games. Oh, we're going to be playing yeah. this for hours on this demo derby. Oh, yeah. Hooray. Can't wait. Yeah. Do, a, do, yeah, do a whole career. Set the price of hot dogs. Oh, if you enjoy Demo Derby, uh, but you notice all these drops here in the thing, you should uh, tweet at Jeff Backlar to let him know I should expense a Retro Tink 4K. <laughs> <laughs> no, that, that's good, because then I'll buy your Retro Tink 5X There we go. Off you. We all win. It's not Backlar's money. All right. That's I don't right. know this shit. Is Indiana or Maryland better? That's a turtle. Uh, then, they're probably the number one and number two, but uh, I think Indiana probably. But what if I want to be a turtle? Well, then go with Meryl. They're okay. both they're one and two. Yeah. Camera is really These neat. guys are He's tall. Yeah. <laughs> True. The basketball players? Well, like, you always hear that, but laid out like this, whole, they're all very tall. They're Some of them all, are yeah. extraordinarily tall. Imagine being 6'2 and being the shortest person on the field. That's wild. Uh, also, imagine playing that. basketball on a field. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm yeah. sorry. I can't. You got, we can only be so bad about sports. Well, like, that, well, one was, that was too tough. Crap, I couldn't who, handle that one. Who knows it's more about good. sports, me or Mitch? Um, Mike, because he is like an active fan of the, the, the Cleveland Guardians. So I think, right. but, and he, you know, but, he uh, follows other sports. I grew I up the watching the Royals, the Chiefs, uh, you know, I yeah, but he like goes TV to baseball station. games now and like pays attention to like well, the I don't Cavs. know now. Okay. Who knows more about 1997 Kansas City sports? Ooh, that's a you got me there, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> this game looks weird. Like the, the basketball court looks strange. I just, yeah, I like, like I, the frame rate though. Like this. Yeah, everything just looks I know this good. is college and whatnot. I still would have thought that these teams have played in bigger arenas than this. No, uh, it, yeah, they do now. Like the size, I think my high school fit more people. This is like a yeah, rampage they, crowd. There, there's no way. The Maryland basketball arena has definitely got to be bigger than this, even then. I wonder if this is just like, oh, we're making do on the PS2. Yeah. Man, I'm, I'm going to that. Uh, Ooh, that crowd. That, uh, they look AW. awesome. Actually, you, it's not bad. They look like cruising. It? They looked yeah, awesome. They look yeah. Cruising people. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's my favorite race. <laughs> cruising or, people. Or like what? Forza 4 <laughs> people or something? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, God. Forza, right. <laughs> you just call them Forza 4 people. <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck? Oh, that's like icing or something. Hey, look, yeah, at so is it, look at it. It's 60 guys. frames per second. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> is it 60 frames per second? It feels like it. It's like it's people are like, man, we 60 frames per second is something new. It's like, no, man, like a shitty no. basketball game on the PS2 ran at 60 frames no. per second. Oh, what are you talking yes. about? My God. I just tried to hold several shoulder buttons and do a trick move. I <laughs> am seeing I'm seeing basketballs and playing and then your brain is just going street 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 yeah, street. Yeah, that's my brain automatically went into NBA street mode. That's incredible. Wow. I, think I, I think I inherently dislike any basketball game where it's this camera angle and not the like side view. Yeah, yeah. this is it, this is actually I'm like it makes the court look small and weird. They would do isometric like early PS1. I remember like live would have like right. weird things. Right. Like, it used to be jam or this. And then some would try like isometric or like rotating and it always felt real fucking weird. What what yes. what like cuz this is the college one. What what was their NBA one called at 989? Live? Not live. No, live is the Final 4. Final 4. Well, yeah, this is Final 4. Yeah. Did they have an NBA one though? Was they, were they oh. hang time? Oh, or sh no. Showtime was the midway one, right? Not showtime. Hang time okay. Or Maybe hang time. I'll look it up. Oh, okay. until, until that shot, this was actually accurate to my uh, basketball career when uh, never scoring ever. 
<laughs> and also, my, also my high school dating career, right? Oh, boy, always <laughs> striking out. Oh, always oh, throwing oh, air balls oh, with the ladies. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> this is boring. I don't want to play this game. <laughs> <laughs> well, win then. Oh, wait, I want oh, to see, God, I do want to see this mini game. Hang on. How, how do you think this okay. works? What? I only have two points, huh? Well, okay. Am I supposed to hold circle and let this? Well, I, I can tell you whatever you just did was bad. Okay, well, that was a tap of circle. Maybe I do a pincer move if I hold it. Nope, I just, it's the exact same. Well, maybe the things pincer in and I let go like a QTE, you know? Uh, okay, but what do you what did you use to pincer? I would try to hold it. You got... Wait, 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 wait. Red stick. Yeah, Red that's doing, something. Wait, what the fuck? It's not doing it anymore. Wait, bow sticks? Wait, bow sticks? This is fucking weird. Oh. It only does it if I do bow sticks towards do the... It. What the fuck? These things should just be completely stat-based. They should just do it automatically depending on what your field goal percentage is. <laughs> It's a, a shootout, oh. by the way. NBA shootout. Oh, oh right, 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 right. NBA series. Yes. They don't seem to be super well regarded. Like 70s. Oh, no. NBA shootout 2002 had a 53 Metacritic game. Oh, it's your Blight Club game. <laughs> <laughs> you do franchise mode. <laughs> All right, I don't want to play this anymore. <laughs> All right, we've, you, 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 did, you did your bed for yeah. God and country. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. We dotted the T's, crossed the I's. Wait, no, other way around. <laughs> I never say that out loud because I'm never confident with that phrase. Yeah, right. You're not. I mean, who could know what you dot and what you cross? It's well, like impossible. If I yeah. sat and thought about it, of course. But when you're just talking, it's crazy. I mean, you thought Jays too. And, I've never had this yeah. issue, and now because you've said this, Dan, I know I'm gonna. I hate that. I hate that. <laughs> Here we go. Someone alert Ben Hansen. I can hear him running over to my house right now. Uh, okay, right note, center <laughs> note, left note. He is obsessed with this. Or is it for, one of them he's more obsessed with? I think I think it's amplitude. Okay. They did a they did a, a Kickstarter back in the day. Sure. Remember? Uh, yeah. Harmonics did to bring this back. Yeah, totally. Harmonics tried a lot of things after the rock band well dressed. Oh yeah. Everyone at home barfing at this no signal because Jeff Backler uh, hasn't let me expensive retro oh tank 4K yet. It is Backler. annoying. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You need. A, you should get a retro tank. I love mine. I was streaming. Uh, what Rogue Wait. Squadron Three Rebel Strike the other day. But he does have a 5x. Why isn't it plugged into that? It is. But I bet a oh, 4K still... would do much better. <laughs> Wait. Wait. What? That would be no Shut different. Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> why why Shut are we seeing up. these screens? I don't because understand. It's, actually, it's, 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 I thought it was because it was changing resolutions, but I thought the the retro thing handled that well. Retro thing. We have, I have no idea what's going right on. Right now, setup. it's going okay. PS2 uh, component to retro tank straight into the capture card. So I don't know what yeah, the fuck's going on. Fine. Oh, press start button to freak out. Oh, is that a frequency reference? I see. Yeah, That's fun. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't know if anyone actually knows. Uh, let me know in the comments, and then someone tell me that there was a comment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure, we're on it. Freak. I love these aesthetics. It's like what the what we thought the insides of computers looked like in the nineties. It's like reboot. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Freaknet, man. Or that one episode of Muppet Babies. <laughs> mm -hmm. Whoa, this is pretty sweet. Whoa. Or the three D Homer episode. Oh God. Yes. Yeah. That's, uh, that's the that's the one with the quote. Uh, <laughs> has anybody seen the movie Tron? Yep, yep. <laughs> oh, all right. Shit. I don't trust this I think guy. You got to be the freak with the headphones, right? Yeah. Uh, We're yeah. allowed to call them freaks because they they use that word themselves. Yeah, apparently. standard right. freak. Oh, <laughs> I didn't even. Yeah, that's what I was going for. <laughs> Mike's been saying some crazy shit on content yeah, lately. He's been, he's been on one. <laughs> Oh, baby, pick Mello. Baby, the way to do normal mode because he might be bad. Oh, this bad. is obnoxious. Yeah. Uh, do you no, believe anyone would do that? Hey, I, I, I think I, you should pick garbage because you are garbage. Oh, my God. Uh, look, you know what? I'll go back. I thought it was the default. I almost always do. Here, I'll do normal. How about yeah, that? Yeah, normal is not the default. What is normal ever? <laughs> I legit didn't know. I'm not doing training. Uh, do I Mello's do? Mello's the freak mode. Uh, Quarashi? Are they big? Do the kids like Quarashi? Oh, yeah. The kids never stopped talking about Quarashi. <laughs> okay, uh, okay, wait. Do you, Iceland. Do you know these bands at all? Do I you know, know garbage? garbage? Okay, well, yeah. I was going to say garbage, right? Yeah. Okay, so. Quar you don't know garbage? Uh, Quarashi yeah. started off rapping in English because they're influenced from America. There was no model for rapping in Icelandic, so we have to figure okay, it out for a second. I want to see if I recognize it. Can you check out Quarashi.net real quick? Yeah, sure. Yeah, please do. This is, they did a baseline. They're still going strong. Are they? Now uh, I'm curious. Garbage Quarash. did Stupid Girl, right? Uh, I think so. 
Yeah. Garashi.net is a can't reach this page. Hell yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. Yes. Let's do it. It gone. <laughs> I did love this game. Okay. I guarantee Ben Hansen made me play this on a Game Informer video once, but I have no recollection of ever playing this. Oh, it was good. I like what I'm looking at. Okay, yeah. Owen, Owen. Yeah, that's right. Do... So Sony published this game. It said you can do a uh, square, triangle, and circle instead of L1, yeah, R1. That, that, that seems better, that one, yeah. No. Seems way better. Is it working? I think I'm doing it. And then you you set it, and you got to change tracks, right? So it's like... Right, once you get it, you change yeah, exactly. Yeah, it looks on. right. And then they come back after a little bit. You have to, like, yeah, complete okay. the sequence. Okay. Oh, why is yeah, that red? Okay. you got it. Okay. You got it. Yeah, oh, there's cool. the guitar. Why didn't anyone tell me this game's cool? <laughs> yeah, this <game's> great. <laughs> Yeah, it's the vocals. You don't deserve it after giving Elite Beat Agents a seven or whatever. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we're still mad about that. I have that on my phone now, and you. I bought a stylus, and I got a specific Elite Beat Agent skin so I can play it. Or am I thinking of Rhythm Heaven? Okay. Which one was on DS? Uh, DS. Both of those. Yeah, okay. they were. Rhythm to Goku was... Uh, and then, yeah, Rhythm but, to Goku, whoa. Well, I'm, not, I'm not sure if, like, did it come out in English uh, on DS? Yeah, I think the first time I got it was on okay. the uh, oh. That's right, that's version. right, yes. I don't, the red and the green has to mean something. Okay. This is, this is a, a sharp little idea I hear. Yeah, I think I remember this song in this game now. Okay, wait, I'll do this. Oh. This is I very love, like, Beastie Boys. the music videos playing off in the distance, too. That's uh, one of those things that the player can never actually see because they have to stare at the notes. Right, exactly. Mm -hmm. I don't think yes. I ever noticed these details before. It's like Beatles Rock Band. It's like you need to play it through once yourself and then watch someone play it. Yeah. Have you heard of the Beatles, Mitch? No. Okay. <laughs> do you like the Beatles? I do like the Beatles. Okay, yeah. all right. I do I do like robot. That's like one of my least favorite takes. Like the Beatles are overrated. I it's find like they're rated... Right yeah. where they need to be. Let's yes, call they're, they're yeah. just fine. I find it's usually youngsters that are trying to have hot takes. Yes, exactly. It is the. Yeah, you're right. It is the most. I have a hot take. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, you Everybody get a load stand of back and listen to this. Yeah. yeah. Like, oh, I'm well, not saying you need to be like one of those people, like my brother, who's naming your kids after Beatles songs. Right. It's fine, but like, come on. <laughs> yes. It's not a brave thing to say. It's just stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if Quarashi gets picked up by YouTube. Uh, it's like the auto, whatever. Yeah, I was shocked because like I was when I was playing Rebel Strike on my stream. You know, those games just play clips from yeah. Star Wars. Mm -hmm. I was like, is Twitch gonna be okay with this? So far, I'm not in trouble. Oh wow! They uh, got to direct this game. Like, I think he also worked on System Shock. Really? Oh, hell yeah! Yeah. Warren Warren Spector. Yeah, I don't think he was the. I don't think he was like the director of the System Shop. I think he worked on it. I don't know if I've ever played a Warren Spector game. I don't know if well, I know what he made. Huge epic Mickey Mark. Yeah, Never touched that. Would have been epic Miss Mickey System. Uh, Never played system, that. Or yeah, yeah, yeah. Then DSX. Nope. Yeah. Thief. Nope. Because he liked the PC stuff, and I never had a PC, so it's yeah. like sure. I don't know shit about Warren Spector. Got, gotta tell you. Um, I've been playing some Commander Keen and oh. Doom and Castle Wolfenstein. Wait, wait, wait. Did you really get into like a classic FPS boot because of Daikatana? <laughs> yeah, and, and because I started reading Masters of Doom, yes. Oh, <laughs> you were reading oh, yeah. Masters of Doom while playing Daikatana? Yeah. Awesome. I love yeah, that. I, I, actually, I just finished the book, so yeah, I, I just read Masters of Doom because of Daikatana. Oh, that's fantastic. Do they talk about yeah. Daikatana? Yes, like the whole like thing, the whole thing starts off with the, the two Johns are facing off at E3. One's bringing oh. Daikatana, the other one's bringing Quake uh, 3, 2, whichever one was right. Been three. 2, probably. Amazing. Two, yeah. I think 2 is the first one that Did Romero didn't we? work on at all. We got Weezer yeah, and the Herbie Hancock. That's a bunch of famous bands and then Quarashi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's online. Wow, this is one of the uh, wow. network adapter games. All right. Uh huh. I wonder, I wonder if those servers are still up. Oh jeez, is this no, uh, on anything? Out. Like, did they ever come to like PS4 or anything like uh, this game in particular? There was, Amplitude. There was like a Vita version or something. Right. Like? Yeah, I thought uh, it was all elsewhere. But they did make that Kickstarter one, right? Did they make that? Or I think they did. I thought there was. Yeah, wasn't there a successor? It was either that or Frequency. No. Yeah. Harmonix one of those. Kickstarter. I'll look up that. Yeah, yeah. Amplitude by Harmonix Music Systems in 2014. Yep, that sounds right. 
And it's coming. It could come to PlayStation Four and PlayStation Three. Uh, Good. Uh, everyone. Well, I mean, tweet back the Lark. pitch. Yeah, like the frequency <laughs> series here just says frequency. Yeah, so the 2016 version. Yeah, it came out on PS. Man, that came out on PS4 in 2016, huh? Wow. It must not have been great. Otherwise, I would be like, like Hanson would be playing it every yeah, time you I go over to his place. You couldn't oh. walk over or past Ben Hanson without hearing about it. Oh, oh. okay. Yeah, I know you're excited, yeah. but you got to play Rayman 3 fine. first. Fine. <laughs> I'll play this. All right, fine. Didn't hey. we get a Rayman in the last one? Yeah, which Rayman did we have last time? Was I it Rayman 3D? We had Rayman 2. We oh. had Rayman 2 on PS1 right. last time. Special right. Invaders and Dangerous Game. What am I looking yeah. at? Jump helicopter? Uh, what? A circle? You have a life bar button? All right. The helicopter is just your the helicopter. Uh, it's, your, it's your hover jump. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's oh, it, okay, yeah. It's yeah. interesting because people love Rayman 2, and Rayman 3 gets not nearly as much love. And I, I never actually played it, so I'm not really sure why, so I'm a little curious to see. Ubisoft games always just seemed weird to me. I just, ne I, there was never a point where I was super hot on Ubisoft stuff. Just hate the French. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Assassin's you know, Creed, Splinter like, Cell, Rayman. I mean, you to, so was Prince of Persia the Lost Crown your favorite Ubisoft I, game ever? I'm a big. I do like the Prince, like the the Sands of Time trilogy. I fucking love. I love okay. 08. I love. I, I'm not big on Forgotten Sands, um, but obviously the Lost Crown is great. Like yes, Prince of Persia is probably the outlier here. I do like that series a lot. Here's the hoodlums. That guy looks like the Mighty Pooh. Oh yeah. <laughs> this was. Uh, I remember there's actual voice acting in this one. Whereas like in two, it was more like the rare style. And I think that worked way better than <laughs> Freeman actually just saying words. It always felt weird. That somebody famous plays his friend Glowbox in this, and it's weird. How famous are we talking? Let me see. Uh, is the voice actor of Glowbox Freeman. What is the song? Everything is looking like the great Mighty Pooh now. Yeah, I, there's something oh. about this video that makes it look like an N64 texture. Yeah. John Lucas Zamo is the voice of oh, 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 oh. the pest wow. himself. All right. Okay. I didn't know we were getting pested. Oh, man. You never know when he's going to strike. <laughs> Wait, okay. Jordan Mechner is the Prince of Persia guy. What was, what's the Rayman guy? Uh, yeah, because he, he was the Beyond Good and Evil guy and he just left. Right. I thought he, Jordan yes. Mechner was maybe, Conan's like I thought it was Conan's like wine Mahardy guy. Uh, Jordan Schlansky is what I'm thinking of. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Sa same thing. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Maybe he sucks, right? Uh, Michael Ansel. That's it. yeah. Michael Ansel, who like yeah left, and there was Michael like, Ansel. Yeah, yeah Michael Ansel. <laughs> well, that's a bad name. <laughs> uh, hello, I'm Mike Ansel. <laughs> Mike Ansel. <laughs> There he is. Does John Lucas have anything to say? Oh. I hope he raps. Oh, God. That's oh, him? Shit. That's a weird No, no, no. That big blue guy you passed. This juggling guy looks like a Todd McFarlane action figure. Yeah. <laughs> oh. You, this 60 frames a second is doing something for me. Yeah. Well, it is funny because, like, we don't get that all the time now. Like, I was playing Stellar Blade, right? You know, like, whatever. But I was kind of just like, wow, a PS5 game that's running really smoothly. Mm -hmm. Dragon's much... Dogma 2 did not. Oh, jeez. Okay, they have muskets. Um... Okay. I... You, you, you throw your fist at them. You don't jump on them. It's not it's... a jump. Oh, I thing. thought Square was. Oh, it's like a projectile. I was. I thought it was yeah, a yeah. punch. Okay. Well, this also seems to be going poorly. This is great. Um, yeah, you, you look like you really got a handle on this. Yeah. It's like uh, it's like Metroid Prime. Strafe as you do it. Yeah. Lock on and strafe. Wait, how do you... Yeah, yeah. How do you... Uh... Z target. Oh, okay, okay. Z target. Oh, there we go. Okay, okay, let's try this again. By the way, I'm playing Wind Waker HD right now, and oh. holy shit, does that game still look and feel great. Oh, it's over. Yeah. Oh, come on. Oh, Wait, no. Thing again? Now I got to go to the wrestling game. Oh, come oh, on. Come Get on. one more guy. Uh, you didn't even beat in. one enemy. All right. Jeez. <laughs> Look, platformers aren't my thing. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> oh, my God. I'll try the other mode, whatever that was. There was another mode? Yeah, there's the special invaders and the helicopter junction or whatever. Now I want to play Hoodlum Havoc. Let's see. Well, which one is this? Is this not Hoodlum Havoc? Yeah, I want to play it this. Is. Okay, this okay. is Rayman 3. Right, oh. Rayman 3, Hoodman, Ray Hoodlum Havoc. Rayman, right. Man, Rayman 2, The Great Escape, which I think is the best. This, and then Rayman 4 was supposed to be him versus the Rabbids, and they just they oh. turned it into the minigame collection instead. All right, let's, right, let's right. play a game. Okay. Uh, name all the platforms that Rayman 3, Hoodlum Havoc has come out on. Dreamcast? Okay. Nope, uh, he's wrong no. already. He's 64. Already lost. 
already no. lost. That's no. terrible. At PlayStation this. One. No, it's no. no. You're what? just the uh, wrong. This is a PS2 game. Oh right, PlayStation Two. Yes. Okay. <laughs> I Mitch? think it. Uh, I think there was an Xbox version. I don't yes. think there's a. GameCube version. There is a GameCube version. There is a GameCube oh, version. Oh, oh, I should have known. Keep going. There's so many more platforms. Oh, I'm sorry, 2003, well, well, there's of a Game Boy, yeah. There's a Game Boy Advance version. It's just a 2D side scroller. Yep. Yep. Uh, Windows. Windows, yeah. I'm sorry. Okay. We're, we're excited here. John Luzamo. <laughs> there it was. <laughs> All right, cool. <laughs> Oh, uh, oh, now we're talking. What right. the hell? Yeah. Oh, oh my Star God. It's the set. It's the set. Yeah. Oh, my God. I was not expect. That is. <laughs> You're doing great, Dan. <laughs> I, just, I don't know the buttons. <laughs> hey, look, at the, look at the fabric physics. Yeah. Here. I mean, yeah, they always have good animation. Oh, hell yeah. Ooh. That's Ooh. why people like love the rabbits. Anyway, what I was good as this game came out on <laughs> Engage. Oh. I knew there'd be. I was going to say Engage. Game.com? No game.com. Uh, it did, did also get ported to PS3 and uh, Xbox 360. Does this cannon oh, have really? mitts? Does what? Wait, what, what was what did we call what water mitts? I forgot already. Hands, like mittens. Hands. Right. Okay. Uh, yeah. Oh, you mean just the thing that physics in front of you have mitts? I thought you were making a Mitt Romney no, no, reference. No, those no. Are, remember Rayman's Rayman's doesn't Rayman's hands like float away from his body. Those are Rayman's hands. Oh uh, right. Okay. They're, they're like VR hands. hands. Okay. Got it. Yeah. Yeah. They do look like that. <laughs> Man, games just loved turret sequences for like three generations there. Oh no, like I think they still love them, but they're afraid to do them now. Yeah, I, I like them. <laughs> mainly Jeez. because the end of Snake Eater is so fucking fun. Like mainly, sure. I'm just thinking of the end of Snake Eater. Man, now I'm like, what is the uh, what would Mount be Rushmore. the Mount Rushmore? I was thinking that too. Was there, it, was that there like there's there. a Gears of War one, right? That everyone talks about. Oh, I'm about. sure well, there is. Yeah, I mean, I there's the one where you're on great. the and two when you're in the giant like ATAT -AT thing. But you can still move around. You're not like on a turret, you know. Right. If you have right. control over a vehicle, it doesn't really count. Okay. okay. Um. There's a Halo one, right? It's one of the escape. Right, there's like, a Halo one. Is every shooter has one. Look at this like, geo mod. <laughs> I do like that. They're like, we gotta like obviously we have to put this in the demo too. I mean, yeah. It's like a whole other game. Honestly, this is like the probably the easiest vertical slice to make, right? Like yeah. the, the character can't. Or the uh, gamer yeah, can't, like, I imagine these things are always because in the 16-bit era, it was like every platformer had a random shmup section. Right. And then like, yeah, next generation and this it was like a ah, turret section. I mean, even Super Mario Land had shmup sections. Are, right. Are turret sections generally disliked? Yeah. Really? They're kind of they're boring. Yeah, they're boring. But they're they're good ones. Yeah, they're mostly simple cards. They're mostly boring and like filler. Oh. Yeah, like, filler is a good word for it. They're mostly filler. Man, I've always liked them. Yeah, well, you're, are, you well, know. Stop. Are you enjoying yourself right now? Well, no. This is what they are. <laughs> this is what they always what are. You the game. Words, We're talking I about Snake always Eater. enjoyed them. If this had Snake Eater music on it, oh, oh my god. Do you just like Snake Eater? Is that all Maybe it's I just like Snake Eater. I think you just like Snake Eater, dude. <laughs> that might be the case. Because <laughs> this is all they ever are. Okay, <laughs> it's starting to get a little nose to be worse because it's literally just like the same enemy showing yeah, up in the same places. You're in the same order, in the same pattern. It, like somehow you're about to die anyways. I don't really know what you could be doing better. Better. Yeah, this is actually okay. kind of boring. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I was playing Final Four. <laughs> <laughs> right. You were slam dunking in that so yeah. much, enjoying yourself. <laughs> Getting game breakers. Right. Yeah. Come on. You, you know you Ooh. got smacked on after this. Oh, God. It's sh yeah, shut your mouth. I'm not telling you to shut <laughs> you your mouth. That's this. the name of it. Nope. Sorry. Uh -oh, nope. Lose. Sorry. Wrestling time. <laughs> <laughs> Could be March 2003. Okay. It's 03. Who do you think, if there are like two select, let's, okay, let's just name two wrestlers that we think are selectable in this demo. Brock Lesnar and The Rock? Yeah, it's, probably, it's probably Lesnar and Rock. Maybe, gosh, 03. Maybe Triple H. Oh, yeah. uh, Bubba Ray Dudley. Uh, yeah, I guess this would have been post draft. Maybe they were doing a singles joking. push. I mean, Booker T. And they never Maybe. really pushed him too well. <laughs> Gold dust. Uh, no, yeah, he's the he was the star. It went Maybe from, you'll get American Badass Taker. Oh, Eric Bischoff. This would be uh, 
big evil booger red uh, taker era. <laughs> oh, is it Hogan and Triple H? I was at this match, Backlash 2002 in Kansas City. Oh my God. This is this is after I was done with wrestling. I was like, oh, I'm over this wrestling thing. And like, I didn't know what was going on. I was like, what the fuck? Kevin Nash is here? All these guys? It's crazy. I stopped around the invasion for uh, eh, all of college, basically. Sure. Couldn't let girls know that I liked wrestling. No, 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 no. Only cool yeah. dude stuff. Like the opposite. I like was out of it during high school and then like in college got back in hard. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> ah, THQ, good old THQ. Jack specific, thick. right? Oh, thick. These are a bunch of companies. <laughs> Ukes, Jacks, what, THQ. What Jack, Jack specific makes some like Action children's figures. toys. Action yeah. figures. Yeah, yeah. Okay. They had the before with the Mattel deal. Okay, that make that makes sense. Yeah. Is this gonna be Hogan and Triple H? Okay, wait. Incredible. Uh, what are the chances that we spend watching? Oh, like, decent, at least yeah, in the video package. Wait, do we not get the like, the do her, who do her, hibba, hibba, hibba. That, that intro? That's this that might have been beautiful. Intro. This is beautiful people era. Yeah, okay, yeah. beautiful people. You hear it? Oh, wow, yeah, I do. Yeah. yeah, it's a great intro for SmackDown. Holy shit. Yeah, this is Fist now, and Beautiful People uh, era. Was this, is this the one everybody oh, loves geez. the most, or was it Know Your Role? Uh, here comes the pain. Here comes the pain. That's right. right. An RBD. And I'm, I'm, I'm the one screaming about SmackDown versus Raw 06 all the time. I want to let this cycle. How many, how Great many people, menu. how many people are super canceled from this year? Takers oh. avoided it. Um, yeah, Flair That's pretty, yeah. Flair kind of rock more so every day. <laughs> he's uh, working on it. <laughs> Tajiri said some shit. Uh, <laughs> Eddie's dead. Eddie. Oh rip. Rocks peeing in bottles. Sure. Yep. Well, shit. hey, there he is. <laughs> well, here we go. Kurt's doing fine. Yeah, you just yeah, keep your mouth there. shut, Kurt. Well, okay. Uh -oh. <laughs> Landstorm seems fine. <laughs> yeah. Stacy's fine. Well, it's not just George Clooney broke up with her. <laughs> sure. Oh, Booker's so cool. Regal. <laughs> Regal. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there he is. Yep. All right. No Benoit yet. I think Benoit might have been injured around this period. Oh, big okay. Shit. Hey, it's Edge. Yeah, the hurricane's Helms. here. Helms is great. Okay, we looped it. Have we looped? Yeah, I think I think we're at the beginning. Yeah, yep. That's a good. big forehead, man. Okay. <laughs> it's bigger every day, too. <laughs> uh, no manager. No manager. Um, oh, dear. What? Okay, it's, it's Brock and Triple H. All right. Eh, I said, I got it. Uh, who are you going to be? I guess I'll be on. <laughs> there you go. With uh, I'll start with five <laughs> pedigrees. <laughs> This is if you would have picked Brock, I would have had some a lot. To, I would have had a lot to say on Reddit. <laughs> yeah. Hey, we, uh, can we check the SmackDown situation, please? Check the situation. <laughs> oh yes, yes, of course. Uh, pedigree. <laughs> okay, for all five of my pedigrees, you just face the grind. This is how actual Triple H in this era started all of his matches with like five stocked pedigrees. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. That was part right, of the so like embargo. Like, they didn't have like a super big face for a little bit there until Cena popped off. So like. <laughs> I felt like the main character of WWE for a while was just ill Triple H. Well, he was face around 18 when he uh, divorced uh, Stephanie and fought. Uh, but then with the evolution yeah, then stuff, evolution he went back like heel. Yeah. Real short right after yeah. that. Yeah. All right. Well, Jesus. Um, that's a loading screen. Every game should have that as a loading. The Last of Jeez. Us should have that as a loading screen. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We got Motorhead, Fist. All right. See. Yeah. This is Remember flashes? Remember yeah. when people had flashes on camera? It was, it was a better, yeah. Good. Yeah, it looked better cool. time. Some of those old like WrestleMania still look amazing. Like like Edge doing the spear off the ladder of all the flashes. Yeah. So. Or like anytime Austin went up to the four corners and put the fingers up. Right, right, right. Somebody had to animate the water bottle. I love that. This would have been, I think, a couple years after this is when the like embargo notes would say things about don't show Triple H uh, taking any damage in screenshots. Like, <laughs> Triple H can never be in the defense in your screenshots in your magazine. Oh my god! <laughs> god. <laughs> I still have to show you how good I am at doing this. No, I I could do this better than you. Absolutely. I, Hell yeah! We'll I, have a I, Triple H. I've done it a I thousand think I times. God, it's a, a, a live show. I think, yeah. Buy your okay, tickets now. Full Buy entrance. Tickets. We need green yep. lasers. We need motorhead license. Okay. Yeah, I might have first, people first use their imaginations. <laughs> first few rows are going to be like the Shamu wet zone. Gallagher yeah. ponchos. No, he's doing the shoulder thing. Already did that bit. Yeah. Minnesota, <laughs> 295 pounds. Bird. 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 He walks like, like a bad person. <laughs> 
Why is he walking so lurched forward? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> fireworks! What? You didn't do the fireworks? On the PS2 budget. Yeah, they saved all those for Fantavision. <laughs> yeah, they had a quota. Yeah. For a stockpile. I, yeah. Like, like, obviously, everyone loves how the N64 games play, but they didn't look nearly as good as this no, graphic. No, You're right. No. Oh, well, this is pre Dick Sword chest tattoo. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. What is it? It's amazing PS2, that we once lived in that world. <laughs> yeah. Okay. For some reason, I was like, we're playing a PS1 game. This is PS2, right? Yes, this is yeah. PS2. Yes. The I guess that's one of my. Yes, the next generation was more powerful, Mike. Yeah, Very that was a good point. <laughs> well, now. Well, then. I guess I'm getting at. Because uh, I was playing Smack Numbers as well. Six not too long ago. And that looks a lot better than this. They've done a lot just in one generation. Well, I, I this bad. have not played the SmackDown series in a while, and I do not remember any of the reversal controls or anything else. It's uh, it's shoulder buttons on. You ju you're just I letting play. Brock win because you're such a mark. That's right. I think yes. it's R. Should be, I think it's R2 for strikes, L2 for grapples. Jesus Christ! Like Is that. it here? It just kind Player of mash them sometimes. Okay. What can I do with camera angles? Yeah, on, yeah. Turn camera angles off. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, here we go. Wait, square doesn't... Okay, X is strike. I'm guessing circle is grapple. Yep, circle okay. Is grapple. Well, circle is like uh, Irish Triangle whip. is Irish whip. No, no, circle is Irish whip. What was that really? beat? Did you hear that? I, I swore. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How do I just do a wrestling move? Okay, circle is grapple. All right. <laughs> yeah. Once you get him in a grapple, you push circle again. Yeah, is it right stick? Direction. Uh, let's see, circle... Is right stick anything? No, uh, no, that's too much of anything. Yeah. Okay. Circle. Well, fuck you. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Okay. <laughs> okay. Triangle is run. I'm gonna tackle. <laughs> oh, triangle. You're gonna run. tackle something. Shit. Oh, that's right. Circle and triangle is Irish whip. That's it. Okay. All right. Get the fuck out. Yeah. How do? I, oh, I got the smack thing. How do I do special? Uh, it's so oh, Jesus. It's L1 in some games. That's why I don't know. <laughs> uh, I'm doing bad here. No. No, you're doing great. Oh, shit. Yeah, you got this. Oh, shit. Bam. Bam. Moment. I also don't know the kick out. Oh, you smash <laughs> buttons. You're wow. lost. A near fall. Oh. A near fall. I'm doing for here. Line. Thanks, JR. Okay. <laughs> there you go. That, that, uh, okay. Just, okay, okay. Circle oh, and man. a direction seems to be a thing. Okay. Yeah. All right. So circle to grab. Yeah, it's like Smash Brothers. Oh, and circle by itself is the Irish whip. That's not an... I mean, mm. that's just you getting him into a grapple. That's not an yeah. Irish whip. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah? You're going to do that? Oh, shit. There he is. Ah! There you go, you dodged. Yeah! Spears! Spears! Yeah, yeah, you did it! Yeah, bunch of... Oh, God. Yep. That, he would always punches. do that move. To, my friend would always play Triple H and do that specific move <laughs> to me. All the time, Spectrum for all six, and I would get so mad. But I remember the running attacks being pretty effective in these games. Yeah. <laughs> I remember I made, like, a creative wrestler. I think I made Conan O'Brien and Here Comes the Pain, and I gave him just a running attack that was just sweet chin music, and so just every match was just 900 sweet chin musics. <laughs> And after that, indie Ooh, wrestlers nice. started doing it a lot, so I'll take credit for that. There you go. Probably right after this was Innovator. Just, <laughs> right? The game they made right after this would have just been the, the one called SmackDown vs. Raw, and then SmackDown vs. Raw 06, 07, blah, blah, blah. No, here comes the pain, and then SmackDown vs. Raw. Oh, damn it. So here comes the pain after this. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, I think that was the last one before SVR. Uh, let me uh, do okay. something real quick, and tell me if this makes it so you don't... Do you still get audio right now? Yeah. Still body. Okay, I was getting an echo, so I turned it off. That should not be on the recording, though. So, okay. Rock beat. Hey, you lost. So this is like, uh, remember when... Uh, Beautiful Triple breast, and, though. <laughs> Triple H and Brock had a trilogy of matches, and uh, Hunter did some brilliant politicking where it's like, yeah, yeah, I'll let you win two of them, but uh, let me win the, the WrestleMania one that people are actually going to watch again. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah. wow. You can beat me in the cage match at fucking Backlash or whatever. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't play too much of this one. I partially since I just wasn't watching wrestling at that time. But I do feel like I missed a lot though, because listening to Deadlock now and rewatching those episodes from that era, it's like, damn, it seems like there was actually some pretty good stuff there.
Yeah, there's Ooh. got to be a lot of stuff to mine there still. Hey, an I was, ATV I was game. looking at one of these at the uh, retro game store. I was like, should I pick up one of these again? They're not I bad. Still, I, remember them wait, being, I play these all the time. I yeah. remember them being fun. It's another THQ. The Toy Headquarters. Sick. That's right. It's a good name. Yeah, I like it. Toy Headquarters, uh, Ubisoft, Ubiquitous Software. Wait, that's what THQ stands for? Yeah. yeah. Toy Headquarters. Were they a toy company at first? I don't know. Safety alert. You ever been on a shoot ATV? I have. Mm, yes. They're scary. Yeah. They broke his leg right in half. My brother and I had, had a horrible gas hospital. inside his mouth. Yeah. Jesus. His yeah. kids got hurt on these all the time. Oh, my God. Oh, dangerous. Riddlin kids and the Lost Prophets. Wait, Goonies never say die. Quarashi! What is happening? Quarashi! Wow. More Quarashi! <laughs> More Korashi. They must have been really big in 2002. I, I, I wonder if like Sony had them signed to like Sony Records or something. Look at it, it had to be right. All right, yeah, that makes too much sense. But yeah. I mean, these are third-party games. Well, no, so no the frequency was Sony not. Published. But yeah. did Sony didn't publish ATV oh, Off Fury. No, they probably didn't. You're right. Let's go to Sausalito. Oh. You don't want to do the track called Anaconda Run? <laughs> that sounds good, too. But I've been to Sausalito. I haven't been to Anaconda Run. have been there. Okay. All right. Well, they were sound to labels. <laughs> Dennis Skifan, Ski Fan, Time Bomb, Columbia, which is Sony, and Sony uh, record label. Yep. They were a Sony oh, band. That makes sense. All right. There you that go. makes sense. Oh, this could be like a Monster Jam course. This stuff's fun. Yeah. These guys are always good. There was like one on PC I remember my brother had where it was just kind of this big open field and you just kind of like drove across these mountains and got ridiculous airtime. It was That fun. sounds fun. What is that? I thought it was one of these, but it was something like that. I don't know. There's a game. lot of these kinds of games there though, were right? A lot oh of these yeah. Kind of games, so I don't know. Sausalito. Yeah, Sausalito's got a lot to load apparently. <laughs> <laughs> I brought up Sausalito in a lot of wrestling promos because that's where my wrestling character's wine bar was. <laughs> 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 All right, X, is this the X to Accelerate era? Yes, it is. Okay. I think so. Yep. It was before we went to L2R2 for everything. Yep. I mean, even like Gran Turismo was like X to Accelerate back then. Oh, yeah. Right, it's yeah. Like, I love, you know, Ridge of Tape 4, but it is definitely still an X to Accelerate game. And it's weird. Yeah, my, uh, my brother-in-law, or my uncle-in-law, uh, he, um, he's a huge Forza fan, and when, when he plays it, he, he remaps all the controls, so it goes back to being A for Accelerate, because he's been playing games like that for so long. Oh, yeah. That's what he's used to. That's like, kind of me, too. I kind of prefer that. Yeah, for Forza, it's like the one series yeah. where it's like they use the triggers really well, so you can That's feel true. the ground underneath I mean, you. Yeah, I mean, back in the day, maybe, but now that we have analog triggers. Right. Hey, I'm literally yeah. using a pressure-sensitive X button right yes. now. Okay. <laughs> there yeah. 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 yeah, there you go. So... <laughs> I accept your uh, resignation. Oh, shit. <laughs> I can't believe like Mike had to resignate, re resign from video games. <laughs> yeah, you heard it here, fellas. I, yeah. I officially <laughs> resignate from video games. Sorry, my brain's worse than usual right now because of all these steroids. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it seems fun. Soundtrack. It's just it's like, like physics. Yeah, it's it is. Or Barashi or whatever right now. It's either Barashi or Lost Prophets, I think. Are these Philadelphia cream cheese containers? I was just about <laughs> to say that! That's oh what it looks God like! Oh my damn it! God. Oh, Jesus Christ! I'll tell you what, it must really look like this! Yeah. <laughs> or our brains are pretty similar in a few ways. No, I think that they just look a lot like Philadelphia it cream cheese. It absolutely does. Which you guys said that. I'm like, oh yeah. That's Which is crazy because right? I've definitely never even bought that. So for me to associate that it had to be some strong branding. Yeah, they got a strong brand there. <laughs> I used to make cheesecakes like, a few times for fun. Oh really? I I put, like, I'll uh, put cream cheese on a bagel. Can't be oh, yeah. cheesecake anymore. Cream cheese is amazing. That's great. So wait, you like cream cheese, but you've never bought Philadelphia cream cheese. So you, this is like no, something no, you no, get no. like. Let me let me clarify. I've never yes, bought please. it in the sticks. I have bought Philadelphia whipped cream cheese in the tubs. In the tubs, right, though. Okay, tub tub guy. right. Yeah, okay, tub guy. I got you. Big tub guy. Cool. I got you. Right. Yeah. Tubguy.com. Yeah. Tub, yeah, tub guy. Yeah. You listen. Eighteen <laughs> and over. <laughs> they could be a grandma and use those tubs to store other things. In the that's future. right. I'm actually oh, geez, thinking. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, but, uh, but there was spaghetti in there. 
Or if it's a grandma, it's more often just the same cream cheese, but eight years past expiration. <laughs> yes. <laughs> there it is. Fermented cream, cream cheese. <laughs> it's a delicious cream cheese beer now. <laughs> I had a scallion cream cheese this weekend. I went to a Hmong breakfast or a brunch place, and they had a sausage sandwich with a scallion cream cheese. It was delicious. Shit, that sounds good. It was real good, yeah. I really came around on sausage in the last couple of years. I was more of a bacon guy for a long time. They're both great. And now, now I'm like, yo, they're both great, absolutely. I'm not like abandoning bacon here, but I'm like, I think I'd go for sausage more often. I do prefer like the sausage patties. I'm not a big fan of that casing. Oh, yeah, sure, it's kind of right. weird. I get that. I can, I can do it. Whatever, it's fine, but I definitely prefer uh, just like the, the ground sausage. Right, ground, ground sausage patties, yeah. I forget. Have you guys tried my custom uh, Domino's pizza order that I always get? I mean, I've not. I Sean does it all the time, and he loves thing. it. He swears by it. Did he learn uh, it from me? Yes. Hell yes. yes. He's, yeah, and he's like, I get it all the time. I'm like, it's like, it sounds like a barbecue chicken pizza, right? No, What's no, no, the no. Difference? It's that, like, no, no, no. The thin crust is critical. So it's Domino's thin Shrink crust, sure. barbecue sauce, replacing the marinara, Italian sausage, right? Okay, and, that's and the cool. cheese. That's and like, you have them cut, in, cut it into squares. That sure, is, okay, that's, like the, the, that's the right. It's Detroit, Detroit tavern style now or whatever. Right, yeah, there's a, that's a different kind of Detroit, but that is also popular in Detroit. Uh, Donato's is the place that I would get something like that from. I, but I don't know if Donato's oh, is like, uh, nationwide. I just discovered something dangerous in that. You ever go to Giordano's, the big tourist uh, pizza? Yes. pizza oh, place? Yeah. Absolutely. They that's have great. one here that delivers to me. Oh, no. Yeah. That's fucking it is dangerous. Me. I did yeah. not know they had them in the Twin Delivers Cities. Delivers to your house. <laughs> Giordano's, yes. Wow, okay. That's incredible. I haven't I, pulled the trigger yet. <laughs> yeah, I know, like, the people from Chicago look down and it's very touristy, but man, it's, they're good. It's Whatever. good <laughs> as hell. It's so good. It's so good. God, I'm going to get one. Maybe there's pay per view. Yeah. Oh, that'd be good. There you go. <laughs> How is it? 19 laps? Yeah, it's a standard ATV race. It's like, it's like a. <laughs> Of like the, the Daytona 500, you gotta go 500 miles. Okay. okay. Oh, that's why it's called that makes sense. <laughs> it's either that or laps. I, honestly, I'm not sure. Much. Yeah, one of, I guess it never even occurred to me that that number meant anything. <laughs> <laughs> Got cream cheese. Sorry, my, my yeah, brain went yep. completely blank and just started screaming cream cheese. <laughs> <laughs> All right, final lap. He may have discovered an exciting new advertising opportunity for Philadelphia. <laughs> In old demo discs. Yeah. Or, or sponsor Monster Jam. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. I surely told you the story <laughs> we got here about when Monster Jam was making the game and they invited a bunch of us game informer people out. Did I tell you about this? No. Basically, sure. it was like 2011 or something, and there's like this weird Activision uh, side office that exists in the Twin Cities. And they made the Monster Jam games, and I think like big, like some sort of hunting game, Cabela's or something. Um, but anyway, they came to the office to show us that stuff, and they're like, "Oh, and Monster Jam, uh, the reason we're coming today is because Monster Jam's at the Metrodome, and we want to take a bunch of your Game Informer guys." And so they took us to like a box at the Metrodome for Monster Jam, like, like one of my first Monster Truck things. I think it was Tim Turry's as well. Tim Turry brings a PSP and is just playing Dracula X during a monster oh, truck yeah. show. Hell yeah. And I was like, you yeah. fucking nerd, look at the monster trucks. It's like, yeah, I love Castlevania Tim too. But yes, he defends it. He said it was only during the downtime, but. Sure. Yeah. And nobody can't hear the music. Oh, he might've put on headphones, no Tim. <laughs> Speaking of uh, shameless product plugs, I just remembered, I was at the grocery store the other day. I saw Prime. Yeah. And I did buy one. Which one? Uh -huh. Which flavor? I was doing contact content with you two to try it. Would what? you like for me? Yo, okay. Well, yeah, well, yeah, well, okay. Actually, no, go get it and then tell us all about it. Okay. It's Rocket Pop. I'll go get it. Uh, okay. it's, it's, ice, ice it's Ice Pop. It's Ice Pop. Ice Pop. Yeah, no, I had one right. yesterday. Jesus. I had one yesterday. Dan, I like the, I like the point of your Tim... <laughs> I like your, the point of your Tim Turry story was Tim Turry wasn't reverent enough of the monster <laughs> trucks. Well, but also, look, hey, let's put it this way, too. Not reverent enough for Castlevania. That's not the way to play Dracula X, right? Oh, okay. I maybe, but you said he had headphones, so I, I don't know. As long as I he mean, felt good. It was definitely him being reverent towards Castlevania and being bored yeah. of the monster <laughs> truck show. <laughs> I think I was trying to uh, get some reverence for the monster trucks. Sure, sure, sure. All right. Yeah.
I'm here. Yeah, it's ice pop. Excuse yes, me. Yes, yes. Yeah, thank you. Is that a 20 or naturally 25 flavored. calorie? So it's naturally flavored with real ice pops, I guess. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Co you know, coconut water. Yeah, 20, 20 calories. All right. Is this your first uh, uh, prime period? This is my first prime. Hell yes. Oh, God. Ever. Mike, it, the ice drink. pops, the, one of the, actually, I got one right in front of me as well. Nice. Uh, it's pretty sweet. Like, that one's an extra sweet one. So I really... Like, extra sweet? I thought the whole thing is that they're all ridiculously sweet. Wait, they're all on. very sweet. Guys, real quick. Are we going to overgrown, undergrowth, or voodoo choo-choo? Voodoo choo-choo. Okay. Is that unanimous? Yeah. This is Zapper. Here we go. All right. Oh, Zapper. I thought it was maybe that voodoo. Because there's a voodoo platformer That's true. on this system. Oh. Shit. Not different from voodoo events? Oh, my gosh. They just is this was this literally the Frogger people? Did they oh, just like try like to make another look. one without the Frogger license? Yeah, that's what it looks like. Is that the Bizarre Creations logo? The pumpkin? You see that? Yeah, I see we but I think it's just an angry pumpkin. This geometry wow, this? is that sweet? Do you like oh it? Oh my god. <laughs> Do you like it? Whoa! Holy Whoa. shit! Do you like it? <laughs> It is very sweet, but uh, yeah, it's not bad. Oh okay. my god. See? It Excellent. tastes a lot like Rocket Pops. Yes. That's nice. Drinking Jeez, a Rocket that, Pop. What the fuck? There is, look, there is no way this can't be anything but terrible for me. It is it's so good sweet. for you. Look at the ingredients. No. Look at the ingredients. Tell me it's not good for you. What the fuck? I only have yeah, 15 look, lives whatever, left. Whatever the artificial sweetener is, it's super, super close. close. Yeah, there must be a lot of that <laughs> in here. It's not like the top listed thing. What the fuck are we doing here? Yeah, the top. Yeah, uh, yes. There's, so, there's technically more water in, yeah. in it than See? that. So it's like what Doctor <laughs> said. Citric acid. Okay, wait. This is um from a studio called Blitz Games Studios, and. Oh. It was founded by in 1990 by the Oliver Twins, and the Oliver Twins is like linked on LinkedIn as, or as on Wikipedia as like they are famous or something. Oh, yeah. like Codemasters? I don't know. They they worked on Codemasters and are they Radio people Worlds. or a company? No, they're well, two people. Either. What are my controls here? Okay, chirp. I have no idea zap. that they like. They're known for the Dizzy series. They worked on Dizzy. Dizzy. The egg. Oh, the Dizzy. Egg. Yes, the egg. Yeah, yes. Oh. there was a zillion of those. That's very European. Oh, it's, yes. yeah. Like I've only heard like Matthew and Danny O'Dwyer talk about them. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I only learned about those like recently because of gaming YouTube. Those are yeah. Have we like they were on the ZX shit. Spectrum and Am 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 Amstrad? I can never say that. Amstrad. I think the Amstrad. Have we asked so, Lucy and Tam if they're familiar with Dizzy? We will. Oh, bet. How do you feel about that fucking egg? Egg? <laughs> no, yeah, the egg. The dizzy, the egg. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, dizzy, the egg. Yeah, yeah. Oh, um, man. This soundtrack Ooh. is good. Shit. I kind of love that they're just like, hey, Jesus. Bizarre amount of people bought that Frogger game yeah. on PS1. Let's just make something like that. Uh, oh, gosh. They also I, made B Bad Boys Miami Takedown. Yeah. Hell I think yeah. I reviewed that. Yeah. A Bratz game. Yeah. They made Pac Man World 3. I, know, I always knew that Pac Man World 3 was like a little different than the other two. Okay. It's very hard to tell anything. Oh in my this god. Game. <laughs> oh my god. You won't believe what game these guys made. What? What they make? Sneak King. Sneak yeah! King? Oh, nice. That's Incredible. a better game. Than this. That is better than this. Oh my god. This is a also they... support studio and FMC. And they were also 2015, they finally. Yeah, they closed in 2015. This is not good at all. Oh, it's, it says it was uh, succeeded by Radiant Worlds? I don't know what that means. Oh, wait. Okay, so you can just rotate. Okay, that helps. Okay. okay I predicted there you go. The, first, the first several sips of this were like, okay, that's sweet, but it's pleasant. It's getting harder and harder to drink. Oh, yeah, look at Mr. It... Mahardy talking about wine here. Jeez. <laughs> Sorry, it's not up to your refined palate. Yeah. <laughs> you agree with me, Jeff. <laughs> yeah, but I can't. St I was about to say, you can't stop drinking it either. <laughs> like, like, you're right. you, you, it's like, yeah, it's too sweet. And you want to stop, but I can't. I literally have one in front of me that I bought today. Yeah. What, which one? Which, now, I, I was not planning on talking about it. This isn't for content anymore. <laughs> I just, this, this is what I drink. Yeah, welcome. <laughs> <laughs> this has got to be the most. I can't believe that, like, the sweetest thing I've ever drank in my life is not a product for kids. I guess, it, I mean, it, let's be honest, oh. it definitely is. No, it's, it's not. 100% for, for, for kids. But, like, it's not the market fuck for it like Kool Aid was. Like, Kool Aid is not as sweet as this, and it's called Kool Aid. Wait. 
What, what does calling it Kool-Aid mean? Is that implying something I've never thought of? <laughs> it's like marketing it towards a K. It's just heavily marketed towards K. Oh, I guess I never and thought of it. it's also like, literally a sugar. It comes in a sugar packet. Okay. Uh, oh. So sucralose is about 600 times as sweet as normal sugar. So it's you know, way better. Hell and yes. And it's actually three times as sweet as like aspartame. So it's like oh, they, can use, yeah. they can use a lot less of it. That's why it's like. Oh. oh I'm going to be set to mark for sucralose now. This is insane. <laughs> How, how, how do people live like this? 600 times. <laughs> Whoa, what the, oh my God, this game sucks. Oh, wow. You should have known better, I do like train levels, though. I don't like this one. Uh, Wait, what would you expect was going to happen there with the steam? I'm just, I, uh, I have 20 lives to lose. Okay. My oh, favorite so soap opera. Imagine how reckless they would be in real life if he had 20 extra lives. <laughs> 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 <It's> big problem. <laughs> Honestly, the first, like, Three or four, I, I think I'd probably be reckless. If I had 20 lives, I think I would probably do some dumb shit. I yeah. would try some real dumb shit, yeah. yeah. Once you're on, like, life, like, once you have, like, two left, you're going to really want those lives back, though. Yeah, 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 but I mean, listen, I, I want to live, too, and try some stuff. So it's, like, just three or four, and then after that, I'll be very careful. explain to you what's happening inside my mouth right what? now. Like, no, 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 hey, we're, we're prime brethren. No, we we, you can we, explain to us. You can talk to us. It's a like safe space. Feeling? I love it. I feel alive. I I do like the way my mouth feels yeah. when I drink prime. I think yeah. I'm going to, like, shed a whole, like, layer of that well, it's not like Captain skin. Crunch or something. God. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the, the fun part is after he says all this, and then you gotta let us know the first time you buy another one. Yep. I don't know if look, that may not be happening. Yeah, you think so. <laughs> yeah, no, listen, you say, the, say that, we'll see. We were all there. Yep. It was all a fun <laughs> joke for, at first for us. What's with all the Halloween theming going I on? Don't, I don't. The Halloween tray, is this like the opposite of the Polar just, Express? Uh, this is just like normal European design, I think. <laughs> what is the. Like, uh, trade Halloween grasshopper. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Video Just game. Shop three words. <laughs> <laughs> it's whose line is it anyway? <laughs> what is with these fireflies yeah. writing numbers? Like I was gonna say yeah. the same thing. This it's really like, sucks. I really don't like playing this at all. It wow. feels a lot worse. In your than opinion, me. you don't like. Sorry, in my opinion, just... sorry, I can't objectively say Zephyr sucks. Okay, okay, go, 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 go. What are you? Are you doing like a high jump over those gaps? Yeah, there's the super it jump. Look, button. It doesn't look different. Yeah, I know. It's like the perspective and everything. It's just not good. You have to. It's not clear when you have to super hop or when you don't. Uh, yeah, fuck this. Oh, I hate this. <laughs> it's ever looks stupid. Oh, no. Look at it's his a, head. It's a cricket. Wait, is there a bonus? I Grasshopper. Wait, what is this shit? Oh, you're finding secrets. Oh, oh god damn it. Oh, I didn't want to yeah, get another. Right. Not <laughs> what I wanted. Not what I wanted. <laughs> Dumb piece of shit. Not the attention. God damn it. <laughs> 40. Right. Dude, what does that mean? Is this like, like yards? Is this like yeah. a roguelite? Like how deep you've gotten onto the train? Oh my god. This. I like the soundtrack. I like this random just like chanting. Yeah, I'm trying to think of what it reminds me of. Okay, good. Zero. Oh. Is this the zero that I have to play or no? Yeah, yeah the zero that you have to play. Come on, you gotta try your best now. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I want, I want some real deal gaming now. Okay. So I got to do the super hop, and if I hold it, I can flutter. But then, like. Oh, it looks bad. Yeah. Oh, that's an exclamation mark. Okay, I can. Oh my god. Go my feet are starting to hurt. Yeah. <laughs> it's not real sugar. <laughs> You're fine. 600 times. Okay, wait, so do I just. All right. Uh. Uh. Oh, jeez. Oh, that's bad. What? Oh, fuck this. Okay. No, no. Get me out of this. <laughs> like, we've played 10 times more Zapper than Rayman 3. One wicked cricket. Levels, four worlds and one wicked cricket. Doesn't really look that wicked. Yeah, but it what rhymes. Cartoon bugs around this time. Or yeah. They? Oh, ants well, okay. and Bugs Life. And bugs Mike. Life, Buck Bumble. Yeah. They yeah. specifically did, like, what's his name? Um, uh, M Mr. Quibby specifically did <laughs> ants because he heard they were doing Bugs Life. Oh, uh, Katzenberg. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, he left Disney. He went, yeah. Exactly. Right, 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 right. He was, and he was upset. And he was going to get his revenge. <laughs> oh, good. Dot hack infection there part you one. Go. Oh, neat. Oh, cool. All oh, right, Mike, we need are... the reference turned up. Oh, is it a video? These okay, good. These are action RPGs. You'll be fine. Oh, I bet it's real anime. Yeah, it, it definitely is. There's an anime of it. 
Uh, okay. Thing, this is one of those like games where it's all it takes place in an MMO, but has a lot of MMO trappings. But you know, it's a single player game. Hey, uh, Jan's like going to be in the dot hack, right? If we ask Jan about, hey, did you like dot I hack? Bet, he definitely says yes. I bet he definitely yeah. likes. Dot hack. I actually never played a dot hack. Yeah, me neither. Whoa. It was one and two. It seems like a lot going on here. What the fuck? Yeah. What is this? What am I taking oh, away from MMO. this trailer? Oh, okay. You're an MMO character. Did MMOs right. exist back then? Well, this is, yeah, but this yeah. is like uh, uh, a offline MMO, right? Like you're just pretending right. to be you're an MMO. Right, you're not really playing an MMO. You're, you're playing a character who's playing an MMO. I see. And then if you die, your head explodes. So that, that's a different one. Have you seen that gamer movie? No. I want to. I, apparently it's better than I than I think it might yeah, be. Yeah, it's completely insane. I would okay. very much uh, encourage you both to watch the gamer movie. Oh my God, this is getting <laughs> I, the prime is getting actually disgusting now. I'm sorry. I'm like halfway oh, through man. it. I didn't know we were going to get into hoity toity mic here. Uh -huh. Oh my god. Wow, this is straight up my hearty happening. <laughs> like, I don't know if this would freeze. There's so much fake sugar in it. <laughs> yeah, but that's the, when the stuff that doesn't freeze. You just shoot that, and that makes you. That's going to add years to your life. You're right. Yeah. You're correct. Thank you. Oh, God, you, you collected him now, too? No, no, yeah, I think he must have just hopped into the Discord. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> I'm afraid to say his name in case I get it wrong again. He's not Beetlejuice. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, we don't want that guy running around here. <laughs> Talking to us about Cordon Blancs or whatever. Cordon Blue. <laughs> or whatever the line is. Cordon Blanc. And then meanwhile, Mike's making a Ted reference. There's a lot going on right now. We got Elf. O's with the dashes through them. Yeah. We got ships with mouths. Like Cabin Boy. Uh, do people like this game? Vex? Which I one is this? So. Vex. Uh, not really, no. It's got like the PS2 version is the 63, like the Xbox version is the 70. I think some people have a slight soft spot. Right. For it. This looks That's like a character game. model that should just be in an Xbox game. Yeah. Like yeah. an original Xbox game, you know? Yes. Ugh. It's like, it's weird because there's like the people who are only used to making characters like Banjo Kazooie, but they were told they had to make something edgy. That's how right. you get this. Yeah. Right. It looks like if, uh, like, uh, when a kid from like a movie is like, oh, I'm going to go inside my video game and I have to be my character. Yes. Like, this is, they made them look like this. Yeah. They look like the Great Mighty Pooh. They all look like the Great Mighty Pooh. It's Great Mighty Pooh's all the way down. What? Whoa, Whoa. did you see the jiggle physics? Do you see that? Yeah. Wow. wow. Yeah. That was like your heart out. That was like one farming game. Like 90% right there. This is my Stellar Blade. <laughs> what the fuck? Whoa. That's his devil trigger. <laughs> you know what? The, from this era, like the best, like one of these, like sort of half edgy platformers is. Um, uh, metal arms glitch in the system. Yes. Or it, is it metal arms? Yeah, it is yeah. the GameCube version. Yeah. Uh, I, I, mean, I had that. That was really good. Yeah, that it's are, really good. That or Jack too. Oh, oh sure. well, yeah. But that's like a mainstream. That's like a big it's, one. Yeah. yeah. Did you just get a goatee in Jack too? Got a good. Yeah. Yeah. Got a goatee. Said, or, he was, he was or like soul pack. Soul pack. Yeah. Warrior Within was that for Prince of Persia. Oh, we're getting a future on our video. Hell yes. yes. Okay. It, it's it's oh, we funny just like how sudden these things would happen. Like somewhere in between Jack and Dexter one. And uh, the first Prince of Persia coming out, everyone's like, ah, uh, nah, this is a kid shit anymore. Yeah. <laughs> we got Godsmack on the soundtrack. Oh, this what is Silent is this? Hill 3, the amusement park one. Because 4 okay. was the room, 2 was the Four's famous the room, two one. Is the one yeah. everyone loves the most. People like 3 still, right? Never gets to talk yeah, about it. Yeah, it's people good. like this one? Yeah, it, it's good. It's just 2 is the one people talk about the most. And then 1, and then probably 3 and 4 are kind of close. Yeah, I kind of hear them interchange. I think these are hard to find. Uh, I, I don't think I have any of the Silent Hills because they're they're pretty expensive. I, think. I was lucky. I bought a copy of Silent Hill 2 on the Xbox, like from a GameStop, like 15 years ago. Oh, wow. Yeah. So I think I reviewed the room. So it wasn't that expensive back then. Was this a new character here? Where am I? Yeah. She kinda right. Looks like yeah. Ashley from Prison Four. Kind of does. Yeah. We were all about short hair blondes and mini skirts at that yeah, time. Yeah, they were everywhere in games. Haunting Ground was around this time. That's another one I reviewed and I don't have anymore, and it was very, very hard to find now. Haunting Ground. That's sure as a logo. Yeah. 
Dang, yeah, haunting ground. Man, I completely forgot about this. 2005? It's sleeveless. Yep. She's also sleeveless. <laughs> Don't wear Dad, sleeves back. it's me. Yeah. Sorry I didn't call sooner. I said, I could see Haunting yeah, Ground becoming an extremely solid survival horror anyway, franchise. That did not happen. <laughs> and Capcom said no. Yeah. Oh my god, I drink like a third of this prime. It's, I don't know if oh, I can Oh, you're it. a weak person. Yeah. I agree. Your constitution okay, is lacking. My constipation is going to be off the charts, <laughs> though, I think. Oh, no, Superlo solves that. It gives you diarrhea. <laughs> Good point. How are you going to be like Logan Paul if you don't drink more of that? Yeah. That's good, I'm from <laughs> Cleveland. I'm yeah, uh, kind of like him. You can make it happen. Oh, I like uh, this game looks nice. Yeah, it looks nice. It does. It's got a cool vibe to it. I bet I'd enjoy it. I do like the amusement park setting. Hey, Shocking. Wait, what's going on? Where is everybody? Those weird monsters? God, people talk about the, the biggest graphical leap. And anyone thinking that it's like... That PS2 to PS3 is bigger than PS1 to PS2 is out of their mind. Oh, I mean, insane. the fucking Metal Gear Solid 2 trailer is still the number one all time. Like, oh, things are different now. Well, yeah. no, wait, actually. I mean, do you count like Mario 64 where it's like a full on we're going from 2D to 3D? Yeah, I mean, it, it depends on how you that's, think of it. Because like that was right, almost no, like reinventing definitely up there. it. Right? Look, I, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm willing to have that conversation. I think that you could probably convince me one way or the other on, on either side of that. I'm specifically talking about a few weeks back, back people were saying the biggest leap was from PS2 to PS3. No. And I'm like, that is no. factually no. wrong. I was there. I Early PS3 there. games looked like late PS2. I mean, they were like HD right. and they objectively looked better. You know, Uncharted 1 was like, like early PS3, but like... It was, yeah. a, it was definitely a leap. 100% yeah. it was. It just... Like, this game, compared to anything on the PS1, is night and day. Unless yes. there's something really stylized, like Fear Effect, which, like, still looks sure. really cool. Yeah. But that was, like, this compared to Silent Hill 1. Yes. Right. right. Or Metal Gear Solid 2 compared to Metal Gear Solid 1. Right. right. Yeah, I would say, like, like yeah, Mario like 64 Solid 1's great, but they don't have faces. Yes. Or, or like, <laughs> they don't have faces. Yeah, or, like, any Resident Evil character from any of the Resident Evil games on PS1 or N64 yep. compared to Leon Kennedy in Resident Evil 4. Yep. Come on. That's it's huge the difference. Yeah, I I would say Metal Gear Solid Two uh, after one is the biggest. Like, okay, this is the biggest improvement on like an existing thing that we knew you could do. Sure. Mario sixty four right. is the biggest. Like, oh, everything's different. Everything's now, different. Well, know? yes, for sure, for sure. The jump to three D was massive. Yeah, I was I was looking at a screenshot of Joe Valentine Resident Evil Five, and I got mad about that again. Oh yeah, didn't they make her just like very just generic blonde? She was a blonde. Yeah, uh, I think I think that's part of the reason why Leon Kennedy is the best Resident Evil character, just because like like Chris and Jill, they the yeah. appearance changes so much each game. It's like this is the same person. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And Leon Kennedy's like, how much is my hair gonna be side parted? That's right. It. That's it. Look out! These are oh, fucked look up at looking this dudes. Yes, combat. I love it. Hell yeah. Yep. Oh, I don't <laughs> that's like what this. I want. I want to play Blue Stinger so bad. Uh, I have watched an entire playthrough of that uh, on the internet, and uh, it's very fun. If you would like yeah. to do that at any point, I would watch you play it again. Yeah, oh, Blue yeah. Stinger, I would be down for a Blue Stinger. I would definitely want to. Dogs Bower. <laughs> it's a good Christmas game. Oh. Oh my god, I'm sorry. I don't mean to keep going back to this Prime is just... <laughs> I thought you were a man. Every time people. I take a I'm set, finishing mine have, off right uh, now. I have a reaction. I guess the son of a doctor is too good for a, a working yeah. man's drink. Well, I, he, what the? Every time I drink it, he can't stop drinking it, though. That's my point. Yeah. I'm uncomfortable. Because the prime? <laughs> <laughs> well, yes, but also that. <laughs> what is this weird, like, mishmash of these logos? You know, this is graphic design, design is my passion. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, God! Everyone's tweeting the backfire again. Jeez. <laughs> I mean, this I has to be. 4K? This has yeah. to be. This, yeah, yeah. This has to be the same video that I already played, right? I, I'll hit X and I'll just back out if it's the same one. It has okay. to be the same one. Yeah. You like auto played? I wonder if they had to like yeah. pay extra to to get that placement. You have to wait a second or two because I was just seeing the no signal. Thing. Yep. Oh <laughs> man, uh, to Mitch, if you could also tweet the backfire to tell him to uh, let me expense the retro thing 4K. Yeah. Hey, we can watch this one again. Why not? Look at this dumb <laughs> no, shit. No. <laughs> Yeah, I think I'm over it. <laughs> Big Bin Laden, Mark. <laughs> wow. <laughs> he, he gets punched, and that's what I like. 
All right, let's see inside the game. We're going to go inside EverQuest Online Adventures. Oh, oh from oh. Sony Online Entertainment. Oh, boy. Oh, I'm excited, man. Whatever happened to them? We all are, Mike. I'm excited. This one, I, I forgot they made it EverQuest only oh. for oh. PS2. EverQuest on the PC. Let me know if you need a hand. Online role playing are you hearing it fine? Yep. The ability to support over 2,000 players Holy per server, server. EverQuest became wow, a immersive I can't believe I never got into this genre. towers, crypts, and evil <laughs> abbeys. Their players could customize and build their characters and begin a quest just in a massive what jo fantasy Josh, world. Josh, Josh Strife playing like EverQuest. Since its release, today, EverQuest has like garnered many awards and become a do. favorite of the online world. The fan base has grown at a frenzied God, pace, Jesus. with players creating their own fantasy They're still going as Daybreak, right? Selling and trading imaginary items yeah, and there's spells a Daybreak on studios. online auction sites, Doing and even things. organizing EverQuest conventions <laughs> kind of where like fans can really get into character. Retirement home for MMOs in a lot of ways. Who are these dorks? And now, console owners oh, will be yeah. able to make the leap into <laughs> some incredible cool fantasy prime WWE <laughs> online adventures freaks makes like you. On the Metal Gear! In spring of is that Gro the country of Grob down there? Is this Harlan Williams? Virtual world. Uh, Broad humble. That's a good name. From your living room on your PlayStation 2. The core oh, design CRT. philosophy behind it was that you could get in uh, 27 and out. 27 inch. Man, look at that freak. In 20 minutes or less. It, it's kind of like it is weird that there were multiple MMOs on really PS2. That is crazy, you know, yeah. Dance the Pop is 11. Is to just some, with some weird That's Resident really Evil what thing. That's really what the game's all about, is to to log on, find they must have been pop. I mean, like with Final Fantasy XI, I think they must have been popular the in Japan or something. I've Final never met Fantasy XI like made really a lot of money. Looks yeah, like yeah. You know, like, I think it uh, for a while it was the most profitable the Final Fantasy ever. Online could be from anywhere in the world. Shatter, Shatter and die. All, all the stars are here. Play the game. God. So Up EverQuest is still active. EverQuest Two is still active. Pirates of the Burning Sea is still active. I like this. Then let the creative juices <laughs> the, the, the this renders. Is like, the yeah. Character. Do you want to be a dwarf, <laughs> good or elf, gnome, or troll? All the staples of fantasy fiction are there to suit your whims. I think most times Pick I see race, like dexterity, and, if it's not like a Castlevania game, when I'm seeing like intelligence, dexterity, and all that stuff, I'm instantly wary. Like a lot of games I love have that stuff, but if I see the word dexterity, I'm just like, I don't know Dan about this. Dan's wary of dexterity. Dexterity is it's just strength for like archers and. But I never know what like it's specifically dexterity, and then there's like. It's if you're dexterous or not. But what does that fucking mean? It's have good fingers. Okay. Is I get like strength, defense, uh, you know, magic if that's a thing. But like, if I'm doing that a fantasy thing, I'm used to uh, Zelda, where it's like I got new items. Does it upset you when intelligence and wisdom are both stats? I don't. I think I'll just put the controller down and leave the room. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Castlevania gets a pass, but you know, that's that's the only good RPG. Yes. Playing EQOA requires quite a bit of communication between players. <laughs> it's a weird screen. <laughs> That's a weird screen. That was the image with that word? Yeah, it's just a flaming word communication. With a skeleton yeah. on a bear? Yeah. <laughs> what are they? Oh, that's a fucked up keyboard. It's like my GameCube weird keyboard thing. This game only ever had one major expansion and like some pre content updates, but it didn't get shut down until 2012 for a. This new yes, version of E2 only MMO, not wrinkles, bad. Especially in That's time. not bad at all. Like about 500 years I do like the design of a lot of Just hey, Let's make a neon PC sign of just uh, the text of our game. <laughs> right? <laughs> These <laughs> fucked up oh, keyboards no one uses anymore. Keyboards. The reason EverQuest <laughs> Adventures <laughs> was set 500 years before the original EverQuest is we wanted Ooh, to explore it's a prequel to the first what EverQuest. happened to Ooh. the elves. And <laughs> Whatever EverQuest happened to the elves? We got to know. The elves had split into two. I never was that much of an ever Although I did get Champions before, of Norrath, which is a, a PS2 action us. RPG so made by the people who did um, the time of that <laughs> Dark Alliance. Time also <laughs> needed to look at that! Look at the screen! Splinter oh, with okay. armor okay. and flaming games! I thought it said Kane speed. Big and armor! Yeah, it's cool! It's fun! You like goofy shit! Do I like MMOs? Yeah. Combat I, what MMO fast, would I have time, damn play? I don't even know. It might be a lost cause. I don't think it's happening. <laughs> wait, wait, what's, what do you mean a lost cause? Like, what's the point? Because if it's not to punish him, is it so he'll like no, an MMO? I don't punish him. I would have like you know, yeah. this is, I don't think anyone remembers this, but my first fucking feature at Giant Bomb was one called 30 Day Trial, where I signed up for a 30 Day Trial of uh, Warcraft, World of Warcraft to see what the hell it was all about. And uh, it turns out it was kind of boring. <laughs> yeah, no one talks about that feature because it's just kind of boring. I remember when you uh, when you played Dota 2 and you went on and you just started like just doing random shit 
you and know, the team was you're playing with was getting so mad. That sounds oh, about yeah. right. Yeah. yeah, I thought it gave her messing around. Oh no, they yeah. don't like that at yeah, all. Yeah, they seem very welcoming. <laughs> <laughs> it made me want to play more. Yeah, <laughs> Man, even I played even Dota two twice. It was like these people are way too intense. We'll need more of it because this <laughs> world is constantly not. evolving. One of the ways we keep the game fresh and interesting for players is we just yeah, a giant pop up just came up on my screen time. saying I need to more agree more to terms to, to use my TV's voice skills, recognition more stuff. More uh, oh, yeah. So more I can't see right to now. To no, no fine. Yeah, part of your well, it's no, just uh, it's, it's a dragon like that might that might surprise you, but it's a dragon. Then I just saw a skeleton. Oh, I'm back. Okay, there's lizard men. Okay. okay. Obviously, you can yeah, if I see an elf, I'm, I'm wary. If I see the word people. dexterity, <laughs> I'm wary. <laughs> what about uh, everlasting like, friends? Uh, it, you wouldn't like <laughs> MMOs, but you would especially not like MMOs from pre-World of Warcraft. Like, no. World of Warcraft was the big streamlining of things, if you could believe it. Oh, wow. They were incredibly weird and obtuse before that. In, in kind of charming ways. Yeah, like Star Wars Galaxies, where it's like you could just be a hairdresser. Yeah. You fight monsters. I like the really idea cool. of playing games with people a bunch of people, together, multiplayer people style, but it just, it, all the cool. wrappings always seem so lame. Like, in the Matrix, that's star, true, it's about. Is it really Fantasy Star Online would be your speed, obviously, because it's, you know, relatively so straightforward. Right. Right. But isn't that elves and magic and stuff? Sci-fi. No. Oh, really? They're sci-fi elves. elves. Space elves, yeah. Is it anime? Is that really just, is it really no, literally anime. the fact that you don't like elves? If it's fantasy or if it's too fantasy or too anime, then there's quite a hill for it to climb. It's not impossible, but there's a hill. I think I could deal with anime more than I can deal with fantasy. Why do you, I, I would love to get to the root of why you hate fantasy so much. Just one of the genres. Because Paul Riker said that can't, that's not real. No, but he yeah, also but doesn't <laughs> like sci-fi or anything. I like tons of sci-fi. He doesn't like action. He doesn't like movies. There, there was just like not. <laughs> there just didn't happen to be a kind of popular fantasy thing when you were eight that you liked then, and then grew Zelda? into other things. Yeah, but like you like didn't. Don't, that wasn't enough, I guess. I don't know why. Well, because Zelda but felt you, like an action game. Like the fantasy trappings were fine enough because it was like, or like Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance. I fucking love that. But you show me a normal was, Baldur's Gate. I'm like, what the fuck is this? What was? Uh, yeah, that's weird to me because they're here? literally set in the same place. Well, yeah, but one of them I press a button and it makes me hit a thing. Okay, but that's fine. But th that's different. Is it literally you don't like fantasy for fantasy's sake, or is it you just don't like the game? I think he associates fantasy oh. with those things often. Yes, yes. And I don't like D and D or understand D and D, and that's D and D seems like the most fantasy thing. I wish you would stop saying that because that's people are going to try to explain it to you again. And I just I'm not going it. to listen, so that's yeah. not my problem. Um, yeah. Here's some cool guy shit. Rise to Honor starring Jet Li. Okay, way better. Here we yeah, go. Came, something, something with a name like Rise to Honor. Yeah, yeah, you want to talk about dexterity? Look at this dude. First time I yeah, it probably has a lot of dexterity. Yeah, yeah. but After use it for that, cool things like throwing chairs really at people. <laughs> See, that could happen in real life. You can't cast a spell. Yeah, Jet Li can happen in real life. You can throw a chair. You can't cast a spell. <laughs> Honestly, throwing Whoa. a chair is kind of like casting a spell. <laughs> Wait, is this awesome? <laughs> Should I yeah, play what was this game? What the fuck? Oh, he ran on a wall. Is this strength? I, I, I remember there being some buzz about this game, right? Back in the day. Well, I mean, yeah, you got an actual good. movie star involved. They got buzz, involved, you know? Cool yeah. I mean, here we I, but I think Stranglehold was like the one that was actually and, and kind of okay. I like Stranglehold. And it's got, like, so what's right. interesting is it has a 68 on Metacritic. It also came out in 2004, referencing which is quite a ways from when this demo just came out. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but I think one of the earlier games was like came out in like 2005 eventually or something like that. Oh, I would probably like this game. If you've seen any sort of a, a group fight scene with I have. Jet, he's got guys flying at him from every different angle. We really wanted to have a 360. Remember when he was in fight Lethal Weapon 4? It's coming at you. Oh, yeah. I liked that. Right? He did a great job in and that. There's movie. that flamethrower guy at the beginning. And that's the way Jet yep. works. And uh, Joe the, uh, Pesci yeah. is back. The gameplay you section on Wikipedia compares the fight in this movie. game as similar to the Xbox character, game Star Wars Obi-Wan. Oh, oh, weird. Interesting. <laughs> what a weird comparison. I have not thought of that game in a while. because you used the right analog stick. Oh, is it like Nina Williams? Oh, is it you got a crab or a lobster? <laughs> this looks awesome. Doing this game is pretty I exciting. I bet this guy could kick my ass. I played a lot of games. Oh, yeah, yeah the definitely. So simple. But for this project, we're using motion capture to give the characters more oh, realistic man. motion. We were able to translate. Like Jackie Chan's stuff, master. To give you a real feel for the action. 
It has that vibe, yeah. Yeah. Oh, that look. I love seeing wireframes moving around like that <laughs> before any detail. Like a wireframe Tony Hawk mode. That shit's awesome. I'm, just, I'm sorry to not feel good, and I think it's because of No, that's impossible. I got tap. It's water. Can be realized here. But it's like healthy water. Yeah, healthy water. Yeah, if water was healthy, <laughs> it is not healthy. It is healthy. What are you basically? Show me, hey, hey, for shoot. Read the ingredients to your father and tell tell me what he says. Yeah, I bet he won't be happy about the soup coolers, Dan. Well, I'm not saying that's like or the dry magnesium citrate. Sounds pretty good to me. We're able to do on the place. You ever read a vitamin like like a Centrum container? There's a bunch of stuff like that. Alpha taco furl. Yeah. Good for the bones. You can feel it. I bet it's got candy. calcium. I don't think he even does have calcium. Yeah, uh, so, uh, but tri magnesium uh, citrate is just magnesium, which is a vitamin. Yeah, that's in my centrum. <laughs> yeah, it's like it, it, it like it's good for if you have a magnesium deficiency. <laughs> okay, what is replay? That's real. I'm not making that up. <laughs> Why are you trying to defend Prime Energy as a health? Because <laughs> it's important to me. Hang on, Sandra yeah, has some cool moves. Oh, she likes Kingdom Hearts. Shit. It's Cut the chains without actually like completing it. Prime energy. Oh, there we go. I... Oh, Cut the chains what the isn't fuck completed. Am I? Man, it takes a while for the sound to come in too. Backlog. Backlog. <laughs> it it's got to be something with your. It's the only thing you can be is your furthest. capture card. Your retro tick should be. I have a brand new light. Like, run through pro, lava. I have like a 4K yeah, then pro you might be Elgato. Set up wrong or something, because I don't know. Wait, what is this? Doctor Mudo. Cool moves. Oh, right. 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 What's, what's this called, Dan? We didn't get to see you pick it. It's uh, Sandra yeah, is telling us cool moves for Dr. Mudo. Mudo, that's it. Mugatu's the bad guy from Zoolander. My mistake. <laughs> <laughs> then you want to aim here. Your reticule at the biker guy. Cool? I never so played Dr. Mudo. Um, I bought it for Bring Your B game, but we never got to it. What the fuck? Ugh. It definitely looks like a B game. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's more Once of a you grab the piece of Terra. Go back into your That's master like a 70 ish Metacritic. Uber powder? And it'll show that you've completed the objective, cut the chains, even though you haven't done it. You say oh, no, no, no. Move, there's three things that you have to remember. You've disrespected you the developer lava, and yourself. Life <laughs> away, but it's not going to be <laughs> enough to make you die. Thing. Once you get to the rock, you want to look to your left. There's the going to be some enemies coming. You have to kill them off first. Otherwise, they'll kill you when you're trying to do this move. Then when you face the ledge, the targeting red kill is only going to turn red for a couple of seconds. So you have to make sure you time it well and do it fast. Good luck and have fun. Thank you. Enjoy your gaming. GLHF. If I was five years older, I definitely would have been just making these demo disc things, and like the, the video segments and stuff. Oh, sure. Yeah. Oh, GTA 3. How to use any vehicle as a taxi. Oh. Backlar? Cool move for okay. <laughs> All right. In this All right. I'll wait for it to come back for you. Okay. Oh, here we go. Last one was a dork to like Kingdom Hearts. Now we got DeMarlo, who. Oh, wait. Oh, God damn it. It went past it. You guys couldn't see it. He likes Metal Gear Solid 2. Okay. Good okay. Blame right. Backlar yeah, for you guys not seeing It has a cool thing where their heads rotating and it's like, it looks like a oh, computer I, I graphic. That before, you it's know. great. Job here is to find Backlar is keeping that away from you and the audio right now. Right here we go. Let's get him. Right, Man, I wanted to sir. play these again, and I was looking forward to that anniversary right, so uh, collection, which was bad. And maybe they got fixed a little bit. I don't know if they're the great to play now still. Yeah. Right. I would probably, I would probably just play the ones I could like mod or whatever and do improvements that way. Because they used like those like weird AI upscaling right. tools on them and just like oh, yeah. made everyone look yeah. fucking weird. Right. Like yeah. that painting that lady tried to remake. It, it was weird to see 2K <laughs> with its premier franchise uh, uh, just do a very lazy job with yeah. that. Yeah. It's Taxi real bizarre. Because okay. I could have made them a lot of money. Ooh, Look at that shirt. The Marlowe's awesome. Another vehicle as a taxi. I don't believe it, but you saw it here first. I showed you. Now, Who's it keep looking it's at? On you. <laughs> <laughs> Andrew House is over there with a gun. It's like looking around like that. Get Nobody can work. know I'm telling you this. <laughs> All right, Tony Hawk 4. Uh, well, you can't see it because of Backlar. Call these interstitials <laughs> baccalars. Oh, here we go. Jesse called. He's a marketing specialist. He loves Intelligent Cube. You missed his head okay. rotating. You'll see it in a okay. second. And find okay, the Tony Hawk 4. How does he feel right. about uh, uh, trimagnesium citrate? 
and you'll see it. <laughs> well, start the if top he's of the screen. flourishing and healthy he nowadays, then he's had a lot of it. <laughs> mode. And this is definitely the one of, of the like, trucks, the classic Tony Hawk that's been the money. longest since I've played. It's Which a weird one, um, but I appreciate and, what it was doing. Uh, it, it was yeah, a needed thing, you know. I definitely prefer the, the session style limited. gameplay to the open ones so like make this. Make sure you and, use uh, it only uh, when you need it. Yeah, they're still good. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, quick and easy way to pick up some cash in Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4. Now you try. Nine eight nine shirt. You ruined Twisted Metal. <laughs> you specifically. <laughs> uh oh, Mitch. What? You I can't, can't see it yet because of backlar. But hang on, hang on. The folks don't. There we go. Yeah, I just played <laughs> this game. Oh, there's two. I did there's 100% two. in this there's game. Two. I could have oh used God. these tips. I could have used this help. This game was not game bad. This game was fun. Oh, Saul, uh, Saul Villegas. He was, uh, wasn't he in the You guys can see him. Saul Villegas. Does that sound familiar to you, Grub? Old Sony guy? It does sound familiar to me. Saul, yeah. Was he going yes. to PR or was he in the media? How do you spell his last name? Uh, V I L L E G A S. Oh, that does sound familiar. Right? Here. He's giving us tre tre Treasure Planet tips. M Mitch, are you taking notes? Nah, I already 100% the game, but uh, <laughs> save for my future speed runs. Oh, for the and trick section. Oh, yeah. R1 button to do a quick 2,000 point trick. Whoa, that's actually pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> that would be good for a speed run, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's really rough. Get up these points now. Memorize, mesmerize. You hear that, Tony? He's got them all mesmerized. <laughs> wow, that's pretty good. Yeah. And as you can see, I just completed this. Objective. Mitch, were you playing this because did this pop up on a demo derby? Walls. No, no, just because. Um, I don't know. I had my PS2 set up, I think, still from Mythologies. And I wanted to play something. Right by the trick icon. Like, I've been wanting to play more retro games for a while, but there's just such a glut of important new releases for so long. Only recently it slowed down. I'm like, okay, I can play some PS2 and GameCube bullshit again. <laughs> yeah. And, um, you know, like, I was just kind of looking what it has. Like, oh, yeah, this Treasure Planet game. I like that movie. Let's just play that. <laughs> Treasure Planet. All right, going to get another uh, Treasure Planet trick here. All right, very excited. We're right here. And go past silver. It is weird because the video shows up in OBS like 10 seconds before it shows up on the, the, the capture window. So if that helps narrow down what the fuck's and going on. Want to take this path mm. outside right here. I think it narrows That's it down to it. I need a retro thing 4K, but anyway. Yeah, mostly, yeah. yeah. Thrust yeah. To die down. This game looks nice. Yes, it looked good. It played pretty well. I think the reason it was like ding back then is because, you know, we had quite a lot of these at that time, but now we right. don't get any of these. So oh. it was a. Uh, Pretty fun playing it now. Now they, they they all they do with um 3D platformers is cancel them. <laughs> right, yeah. That's my favorite thing about them. What's the big one recently that got canceled? Uh, the Donkey Kong uh 3D game that what? Uh, Vic Vicarious Bears Visions Bears was making. Right yeah. What? Is this confirmed? Engine right here. Yeah. yeah. What yeah. the fuck? Hidden it was gonna roll. Right uh, and, and then, then Activision didn't that, want to make it because they got bored. Yeah. So instead of that or Tony Hawk three and four remake. Uh, Which they, they also didn't do. Yeah. Blizzard. Uh, and then, and but in between that time, instead they worked on Call of Duty. Right. Yeah. The immediate uh, thing was like, no, you're gonna work on Call of Duty. I mean, I like Call of Duty fine, but come on, give me some I Donkey Kong and Tony Hawk. No. I guess yeah, it's been a while since I. It's probably that yeah. Modern Warfare One and reboot the was the last time I was like into Call of Duty. So early twenty twenty. Right no, yeah. no. Donkey Kong 3D from Vicarious Visions needs more resources. That would have been. Um, they did such a good job with the Crash Bandicoot and uh, remakes, and then yeah, obviously the Tony Hawk One Plus Two. Right yeah, that's a freaking tragedy. What you want to do is climb. I up. could drive to Raven. They're just in Wisconsin. And I could try to talk to someone and see if they'll again. make yeah. uh, Tony Hawk. On, Avoid the barrels. laser beams. We're jumping over them. This is less of a trick and than just uh, showing how he beats this, this one right challenge. And yeah, he just wants to wants show off. That's fine. Look, look he, he didn't have Twitch like you do. <laughs> I know. Continue down to the end of the hallway. This is not a bad looking game. Will be the beacon. No, no, no yeah, I think, they, I think they did a good job considering that they probably didn't have the biggest budget. Yeah. The key to starting and completing this objective is to locate that small floating platform outside the Arcturian Trader. Just do exactly what I did, and that'll take you all the way to the beacon. Thanks, Good Saul. Can have fun. Thank you. Kind of looks like GLHF. <laughs> All right. Uh, Sky Gunner.
Wait, it's, it's a download. Net ease now. Oh, sorry. This is a download that will consume uh, 278 kilobytes. Okay, we'll download it. I mean, I guess I have a memory card in here. It's writing five files my memory card. Okay. Cool. Mike Tyson heavyweight boxing. Oh. Uh, download. I wonder how many people bought that hoping it'd be something like Punch Out. Uh, yeah. I probably got excited anytime I saw Tyson on a game, and then it was not Punch Out. Nope. Uh, okay, I'll download this for Mike Tyson's heavyweight boxing. Is this face tattoo era? Did he have? I think yeah. he, was it around this time. No. This would have been around the Lennox Lewis fight, which I don't think he had the tattoo yet for. All right, well, I got a save file. Yeah, this would probably be a little bit early for that because this is like just barely up in the nineties. Yeah. Uh, and then extras. Oh, we got music videos. Was that Corn? On tour with Corn. Yeah, yeah, let's go. But hang on. First, we're going on tour with PS2. Okay. And then we will go on tour with Corn. Wait, we got a couple. We're going to Final Four in New Orleans. Okay, let's do it. God, I'm worried about spring break. <laughs> <laughs> April the minute. That was WrestleMania time in New Orleans. What am I looking at? Is it just this? Do I have to press a button? Just I don't. This. Are they just telling us that they're going to be at New Orleans? <laughs> I, just hit, I just hit X. <laughs> oh, yeah. This, this would have been like around, this would have been early in 2003 because that uh, Rayman demo was for March. Is it just this? Okay, cool. Yeah, I think they're telling you like where they're gonna be. All right. Come hang out with PlayStation. Well, I better see corn in motion right now. Yeah. Okay, good. Okay, sweet. <laughs> okay, you're not seeing it yet, but there's definitely corn happening. And ATV <laughs> Off-Road Fury 2. I think corn was opening for Parashi. Right, uh, that makes sense. <laughs> Yeah, corn. I'm a corn fan. Corn's great. <laughs> corn is great. <laughs> Man, that guy looks like That's a corn, a corn fan. fan for sure. <laughs> Shelby Fieldy. <laughs> okay. Where's oh, Monkey and Head? It's a contest winner. A and it was a six caller. I kept getting cut oh, my. Oh, he called it a live 105. Oh, Do you think my. if you explain that to a kid, they would like like a 20-year-old, they would explain, oh. understand what you're talking about? I've spent hundreds of hours trying to call in a radio contest. I won a bunch. It was great. Well, good for you. Kids, kids, kids missed out. Recently, Corn and ATV <laughs> Off-Road Fury 2 I think I saw Fieldy. Together across yeah, the I country. saw Fieldy too. <laughs> <laughs> One lucky fan won the chance to come And that was Monkey oh, and or Head. Dude, some shirts game. are really happening here at this Corn concert. <laughs> you see the green flame shirt? It was crazy. I know it's like impossible to really to understand like, the return Davis. on investment on advertisements him, like blast. this, but God, do I wonder. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All this time spent the members of filming this I, and like I setting up one of their new songs like here to stay the stations at a corn concert. I think yeah. they don't think about it though. They're like, listen, I, I got paid, everyone else got paid. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and the person in charge of like green lighting this the, the, doesn't want to know. Right. Like, well, we had a marketing budget and we yep. did something with that budget. Right. I'm gonna start and here's the video that's proof we did it. I'm gonna start yeah. making my look uh, look like Jonathan Davis. Yeah, you that. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say would be good for you. I'll shave the beard. I might have to. I'm gonna go to Turkey and get some implants and get giant dreads. Do you have an Adidas tracksuit? I literally have it. I have a black and white Adidas tracksuit upstairs. Yeah, I thought you did. Yeah. Uh, full on top and bottom. Yes. <laughs> Style, I just go for it. It was fun. I was keeping up with this guy. I love this guy. I, took the lead a couple times. I knew I so many of that guy. Yeah, I worked with that guy in a million places. Yeah. Yeah. That guy took 90 <laughs> smoke breaks every shift at the AMC uh -huh. concession stand. Right. And he, and he <laughs> wasn't a good worker, but he never was like mad or anything. Yeah, he was right. like a chill, chill dude, so like, but he yeah. sucked at what he did and got fired. Yeah, he he like, sucked, but he's like sucked in like a really nice way. Yeah, but he got like fired because like he was on mushrooms during his shift and the roller right. wouldn't come out of the vending machine in the break room, so he just kicked through the glass. Exactly. He got pinned underneath it, but yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I had friends like that, but like, like from my first jobs. But like the last time I ever hear from them is when they call me asking for money or something. Oh, it's like, ah, uh, dang it. The shirt, the best things in life are dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yes. Man, that's what it's like to be on tour with porn. God. You it's never know what you're going to get with these demo discs. <laughs> well, I know what I'm getting sent to my house soon, and that's a PlayStation 2 Tone Royal black pullover jacket. <laughs> uh, oh, I would like that. <laughs> I would too. 30, $36? Man. Shipping? Back what a steal! Yeah, the shipping's probably like twenty bucks. <laughs> okay, that's oh, that's that's hideous. That that's is too not a good shirt. Right. That's gonna go right over the nipples. That's so not a good shirt at all. Look. Yeah. 
Is that it? Oh, ooh. That's Is handsome. That's a carrying case. Oh, for, okay. You hold the PS1 and the screen, probably. Damn. Twenty nine ninety nine. Okay, looking good. Looking good. All right, then. You too Man. could look good, yes. All right. Gary, oh, we another classic. Thanks, Gary. <laughs> Manuel, Jerome, Chris, Chris, Kim, Chris, thank you all. Chris Dan, yeah. yeah. Another Chris. Andrew House, thanks for putting this together. Yeah, Andrew, Andrew House was slaved over this demo disc. He's the one who burnt the DVDR. Not, That's right. I, I think it was as hard as that submarine one, but not bad. Sure. <laughs> Sorry, Mike. I, I apology not accepted. No. This one had a wrestling game and corn. Corn and Rayman, John Luzamo. <laughs> oh yeah, John Luzamo. Yeah. All the stars were here. That's wow. Nice work. Man, I was really hoping that the music was gonna be by uh, what's its face? Yeah, <laughs> Karachi. Yeah. Yeah. Quanchi. He's by Quanchi. <laughs> All the kids are going, oh, there's Davidson, hey, Gary Steinman. All right, there's some names yeah, there. Yeah. All right, yeah. Those are going to be fine. Any special things? Say Karachi. Yeah, thank him. Mark, Mark Hamill? Hamill? Uh, okay. What? <laughs> I don't, why would they, what? There was, I mean, he, he was a voice actor in a bunch of stuff. Oh, yeah. yeah maybe. There's nary a Star Wars here. Yeah, but he was a voice actor in a lot oh, of stuff. Oh, he was a voice back then. He was a voice oh, actor I, for everything yeah. but Star Wars. Wait, was he? Did he? Um, was he in Treasure Planet or whatever? Oh, no. it wasn't in the movie. Well, folks, that is a demo derby. I feel like we went inside the game. I think we went inside the game. We checked out the playground. Uh, this was this is a fun one. I but, yeah, let's uh, let's do this real quick. Pick a winner because I think that that Jet Li game was was mine. I'm like pretty curious about that. From the playground, I think. Uh, yeah, that's probably mine. Oh wait, no signal. Sorry. Thanks, uh, Bacalar. Thanks, Bacalar. Thanks, Bacalar. Uh, Started playing the Fugitive Hunter thing, and now we can't see I, it. I think Amplitude was the most fun looking game that we got to play. Although, sure. Okay. Okay. I'm Put intrigued. it this way. Put it this way. I'm going to read all these games, all right? And you are, let's just say you're 16. I know we weren't 16 in 2003, but you're, let's say you're 16. Christmas is coming up. You get one game every Christmas. You get to pick one of these, okay? Oh, okay, okay. That all right. changes things. All right. I'm going to read these. NCAA Final Four 2003, Amplitude, Rayman 3, SmackDown Shut Your Mouth, ATB Off-Road Fury 2, Zapper, Dot Hack, Vex, Silent Hill 3, Fugitive Hunter. Which one are you asking for? I'm probably going with SmackDown. Back, I think, yeah, go ahead. Is it? Yeah, back when I was 16, for me, it probably would have been Amplitude. Where I would have. When been. I was 16, I, it, it would have been Rayman 3, uh, but I think now it would be Silent Hill 3. I was saying Silent Hill is up there too. Yeah. yeah. That probably would have yeah, been so my yeah, second one. Silent Hill 3 is a game I never would have played when I was actually 16, but now I definitely would. Yeah, yeah it, looks, it looks pretty cool, actually. All right, cool. Well, that Good is work, another Dan. demo disc. Grub and Minati, always fun. This Thanks, man. That was a good time. Thing. I can't fucking. I got. Chug it! Uh, you just talk thing. over him. Chug it! You, it. you can't air this. Can't air this. Yes, sir. Cut it. Cut it. Cut it. Cut the cameras. We're done. Uh, Get out of here. 